American Comics Against the Sky Comprehension, Creating a Saiyan Cultivation Method Chapter 1 Wandering Babies, Heaven Defying Understanding. America, 8th Avenue and 34th Street, New York. The alleys extending in all directions are a good place to escape and are also a feature of Hell's Kitchen. At a corner, A. I. Lee looked around in a daze. I just read this Marvel novel, and made complaints about the other party writing the original form of cruelty. Open your eyes again and you will arrive at this inexplicable place. Is this my hand? A. I. Lee, who sensed something was wrong, rolled his eyes and soon saw his hands. Pink and tender, meaty, very cute. But the key is that this hand is a baby's hand. Become a baby yourself? Could it be that he was reborn to the time when he was just born, so he had to do it again? Here is the street. Am I abandoned? My mother said that I was picked up from a garbage dump when I was a child, but it is true. So, when will my mother come to pick me up? If you don't come again, you will starve to death. You have traveled to the Marvel world, because this time you have penetrated the original barrier, the mother of the earth gave you a gift in the previous life, and you have gained endless understanding. Marvel world? A. I. Lee understood immediately after hearing this term, so his time travel is still related to the novel that he complained about. It was thrown directly into the Marvel universe. So it's impossible for my mother to come and pick me up, but how can I live if this goes on? A. I. Lee is a little distressed, he is a baby now and can't walk at all. Looking at the surrounding environment, it is obviously adjacent to the roadside of the main road, but the environment is dirty and messy. It must not be very safe. Just when he was worried that he would die before he left the school, a series of footsteps sounded. When A. I. Lee heard the movement, his mind moved, and he had a solution. He hurriedly lifted his neck and began to cry. Wow 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 wow! The cry of the baby instantly resounded all around, turning into a bright light in the endless night, attracting a lot of attention. Surprisingly, the sound of footsteps was not moved by it, and it was still the same pace as before until A. I. Lee saw a man in a white suit leading the way. Obviously his crying was already so miserable, but the other party was unmoved, not even turning his head. The other footsteps around are the other party's attendants, each in a suit, actively guarding the surroundings, but they don't even look at the baby. Until a blonde woman looked at him with an expression of hesitation. There's drama. A. I. Lee immediately continued to cry after realizing this. Sure enough, the woman couldn't bear it anymore, stopped and leaned over. What a poor child. The blonde woman's eyes showed love and affection. The main reason is that Vanessa has no children yet, so today she pestered her husband to accompany her to pray and pray. But I didn't expect to meet this baby on the way home now, and subconsciously thought of today's prayer. Could it be that the Lord gave me this child after hearing my voice? Your understanding is penetrating the language, and you have mastered English perfectly on the basis of your previous life. Hearing the woman's words, Ailey found that he understood the other party's words. This is a standard foreign language, and he actually understood it completely. This heaven-defying comprehension is really useful. Understanding the woman's guess, Ailey tilted her head and leaned on the other side very cooperatively, looking like a good baby. Sure enough, Vanessa was very pleased with the other party's attitude, and turned to look at her husband. Fisk, what do you think of us adopting him? The man frowned when he heard this because he noticed that the baby was of Chinese descent. This doesn't seem to be suitable for them to adopt, after all, both of them are authentic New Yorkers. Isn't it weird to adopt a Chinese American? A. I. Lee understood that the decision was not up to the woman, but to her husband, so she looked hard at the man for a moment. In a white suit, with a bloated figure, he looks like that kind of fat person. But the height is really high, maybe about two meters. In this way, Dashi Johnson is several layers weaker in front of him. Moreover, the image of the other party is also very domineering. Observing him with a calm expression on his face makes people feel extremely cold. A pair of eyes seem to have countless stories, exuding brilliance and wisdom. At this time, A. I. Lee noticed that the other party's neck was protruding. He thought the other party was a bloated person, but he found that the other party's neck muscles were extremely obvious. This is not the case for fat people, which means that the opponent's huge amounts of body shape are not due to obesity at all, but are all muscles. Another possibility is that the other party is a racing driver who specializes in neck training. Look, he's not afraid of you, he's also very curious about you. He really fits. Vanessa noticed that A. I. Lee was not only not afraid of her husband, but was always watching curiously, and immediately smiled. The man also saw this in his wife's words, and there was approval in his eyes. 
Okay, it's a good match. The first time I spoke, I accepted A. Eilie. He is scary. The baby saw the existence of crying directly, so he just passed by and heard the baby crying and didn't care at all. Now the other party is not afraid of him and is still very curious, which really makes him feel better. Wood. Vanessa happily hugged A. Eilie and walked towards the extended rolls on the side of the road, muttering in her mouth. From now on, you will be a member of our family. Your mother will be me, Vanessa Fisk. Your father will be him, Wilson Fisk. Jinbin, let's call it this. Jinbin said on the sofa in the car facing each other. Jin is not his changed name, which he prefers. After learning that her adoptive father is Jinbing, A. I. Lee's first thought was how cool it is. No one wants to live a miserable life after being reborn, hungry and full, right? No matter how you say it, Jinbin is also the underground emperor of New York, and his life can definitely be said to be worry-free. Isn't it good to just rush at this point? A few months passed, and A. I. Lee also adapted to the life here. Definitely the most is his adoptive mother and nanny to take care of him. Most of the time, A. I. Lee is asleep, because this is a baby's necessary growth path. But when he is awake, he can't let time go by in a daze like a baby. So he began to study his own heaven-defying understanding. Taking advantage of these months of waking up to study, I finally got some results. With your belief in studying the mysteries of your own body, you have an epiphany. Created the breathing method. New book is coming. Chapter 2 Cell Forging Method, The Birth of S-Cells It's finally done. A. I. Lee knows that his breathing method must not be perfect now. It can only be regarded as an advanced technique, but it is also very good. I hurriedly started to practice according to the method I thought. Breathing slowly slows down, and the gas swallowed and exhaled between each breath will swim around in one's body. The walking route is a bit like Little Zutan in a martial arts novel. In fact, the most important thing is your heart and lung function. It seems that he slowed down his breathing rate, but the amount of oxygen he inhaled increased a lot each time. Eilie can clearly feel that her cardiopulmonary ability is being strengthened. Level 1 is enough, and it is enough to lay a solid foundation for yourself. Feeling his own body, A.I. Lee stopped comprehending the breathing method very contentedly. Excessive practice will only lead to deformities in one's physical development, and one may become a giant in the growth stage. The first thing that comes to mind is his adoptive father, Jin Bin, with his tall, seemingly bloated body. Although full of power, it doesn't quite fit Alan's aesthetics. Thinking of becoming the second Jin Bin, A.I. Lee couldn't help shivering, and stopped thinking about exercising his body immediately. For several months, A. I. Lee has been relying on breathing techniques to improve his physical foundation. Only with a good foundation can the growth potential be higher. During this period of time, his performance has also attracted attention. Under normal circumstances, there is almost no noise, which makes Vanessa like him even more. After all, I always heard that babies are difficult to take care of when they are young. Vanessa was still a little worried, so she asked three nannies to follow her. Now that she can take care of her alone, she naturally feels that A.I. Lee will definitely be a very obedient child in the future. After telling this to her husband, Jin Bing also expressed his liking with relief. Then seeing the situation of A.I. Lee, Jin Bing showed a look of surprise in his eyes. This child will definitely not be ordinary in the future. Jin is not an ordinary person, his vision is definitely vicious. In A.I. Lee, he saw the other party's ability, an ability that can be cultivated. That's definitely, he's my child and yours, Vanessa replied bluntly, not knowing what her husband was thinking. A.I. Lee just smiled at the two of them, and continued to look at the moon in the sky. In the past few months, he has been feeling the moonlight, especially the light reflected from the moon by the sun, feeling it carefully. At first he wanted to feel from the sun. After all, it is good to bask in the sun more, and everyone understands this truth. And when you come to the Marvel Universe, you have to think of DC, Superman can draw power from the sun, and he wants to try it too. But unfortunately, a baby's body can't withstand the sun for too long. Vanessa and the nanny stared very closely during the day and didn't let him continue to bask in the sun. At most two hours a day, too short too short. And moonlight, no one cares. A.I. Lee struggles to open the curtains most of the time, and then crawls under the moonlight to feel the soft light. This kind of soft moonlight will not cause any harm to his body, but instead makes A. I. Lee feel comfortable. If this goes on, I won't come up with the werewolf cultivation method, will I? A. I. Lee guessed suspiciously, after all, werewolves are associated with the full moon. 
You have studied the relationship between the human body and the moon for a long time, and with the cooperation of the breathing method, you have discovered the difference in the color of the moon, and created the moon breathing method. Moon breathing method. Ingesting the light of the moon through breathing, the body can get more energy supplements and increase the vitality of the spirit. You feel the particularity of Brut's wave from the moonlight, and the Brut's spectrum strengthens the activity of your body cells. You have an epiphany, created the self-forging method. Self-forging method, Brut's waves extended from the reflected light waves of the moon can enhance your cell activity and enhance the S cells in your cells. S cells? A.I. Lee felt the changes in her body, and was attracted by this name. My own subconscious defines this thing as an S cell, which seems quite appropriate. But this thing seems to be owned by the Sei I Yans in the previous life, why would I be partial to this? Could it be that he also wants to be a Sei Yan in his heart? Thinking of whether it is Kakarot, Vegeta, or Broly in the animation, Ai Li is a little excited for a moment. Who didn't want to be a Sei Yan when they were young, and who wouldn't know how to move came a Kai Gong wave? Although I didn't take the initiative to develop in this direction, but my subconscious, or inner desire is this. Sei Yan, Super Sei Yan. A.I. Lee looks up at the moon, maybe this is the way to improve himself. But I don't want to be an ape, let alone a tail or something. Say I yans are a kind of blood after all. I just rely on my understanding to find the cultivation method. I don't know if I can succeed. Since Say I Lee started cultivating the S cells in his body, his appetite has also increased a lot. At eight months, other children drank three or four meals of milk a day, each meal was about 200 milliliters. And a I Lee is five or six times a day, every meal less than 400 milliliters will appear hunger. This is the extent of adding two bowls of rice noodles at noon. Vanessa has been anxious about this for a long time, worrying whether a I Lee has a physical problem. In a hurry, they found Kim and contacted their personal doctor. Jinbin was shocked after seeing the test results, staring at a I Lee as if looking at a treasure. And since then, a I Lee's food intake will no longer be concerned. As long as he doesn't say enough, the kitchen won't stop. A.I. Lee also knows that he eats too much, the food energy is absorbed by his body. In particular, the demand for S cells is very large, and eating is also a key point to increase cell strength. But eating all the time is still a bit tiring. A.I. Lee is a little dissatisfied with spending too much time on chewing in a day. Then, you are dissatisfied with your food intake and absorption speed, start to perceive your body's absorption method. You have an epiphany, created the swallowing method. Phagocytosis method, absorb the nutrients of the food to the greatest extent, completely integrate into the cells of the body's organs, and the extraction amount can reach 100%. It's done. A.I. Lee felt the change in the amount of nutrition he extracted from food, and showed a smile. Chapter 3 Bullseye threatens Jinbin. I want to hire you. Boom. Boost. Did you not eat at noon? Let me see your strength. You can't even beat a child. That's why your father gave you money? Get up, a bunch of trash. Looking at the fallen men in suits all around, A.I. Lee said dissatisfiedly. But even if he belittled them so much, none of these people could stand up. A maid came over and handed over a towel, and casually took it and wiped her cheeks. Where's my father? A.I. Lee asked casually. The master is receiving guests in the office. Nodding, A.I. Lee knows that dad has been very busy these days. It seems that someone is causing trouble in Hell's Kitchen. This is the base of their family. When they were still expanding their power outside, someone came to the lair to make trouble. How could the father Jinbin bear it? So he naturally began to find a way to solve this bug. Lifting his feet and leaving the training room, Ailey walked towards the front yard. After he left, the sparring partners worked hard to get up one by one. Hiss. The young master is getting more and more merciless. Come on, if he is serious. He might lose an arm or break a leg. How did he train, and why does he improve so much every time? He he, I could still see his movements last time, but now I don't even notice him moving. Don't say a few words, if the boss knows that we are talking about this, be careful to pick our skin. They discussed in twos and threes in low voices, with helplessness and aggrieved faces mixed on their faces. To be honest, they were also very embarrassed when A.I. Lee said that they couldn't even beat a child. But the problem is, they can't even see the figure of the young master when he started to fight, how can they fight? Said to let them come to sparring, but in fact they feel. I came here to be abused, to be a sandbag. If this goes on like this, the young master will probably become the one who can fight the most. 
I don't know who is more powerful now, the young master and the boss. It's a pity that the boss has a young son, and I don't know if the position will be snapped. When the leader heard his subordinates talking more and more excessively, and mentioned the future of the gang, his face immediately changed and he slapped him on the face. Now everyone woke up, they discussed a lot. Everyone is silent and dare not speak, let me give you a hug. As soon as A.I. Lee arrived at the front yard, she saw her mother, Vanessa, holding her child. Hastily walked up to take the baby and tease the other's face. Looking at the baby in her arms, it's no wonder that Vanessa always liked to tease her face when she was a child. I thought that in the anime of Crayon Shin-chan, Xiao Xin's face is a bit exaggerated, but only when I see my brother, I know. It turns out that babies can really have such big apple muscles. Going to fight again? Vanessa said a little dissatisfied when she saw the folds of A.I. Lee's clothes. Ah, uh, no, it's just practice. It's not fighting. Hearing what his mother said, A.I. Lee hurriedly explained that he knew that Vanessa hated him fighting with others the most. She always feels that A.I. Lee's focus now should be on learning. Then you should also pay attention. Your father's subordinates know your identity, so they will let you but they always let you win like this. What if you swell and cause trouble outside? You are still a child. Although you are ten years old, you must control your temper. Don't take it out on them when you are a little unhappy. They regard you as the young master, so they let you. Yes, yes, yes. A.I. Lee reluctantly agreed. Let me? I'm afraid they won't even be able to touch the corner of my clothes. But her mother, Vanessa, who doesn't like fighting, has never seen herself fight, so she doesn't know what happened. Seeing his son A.I. Lee absent-mindedly listening to his teaching, knowing that what he said is useless, this child seems to have entered a rebellious period. Thinking of something, she smiled and said suddenly. You still put your studies first, let me arrange a school for you. Ah. Uh, A.I. Lee was taken aback by teasing his younger brother's smile, feeling that life is not good. Go to school? Stop it. I'm going to find my father. After returning his three-month-old brother to his mother, A.I. Lee turned and left. You can't pick up the bait, or Vanessa will definitely pressure him to go to school. He he he. Vanessa couldn't help laughing when she saw A.I. Lee running away. She knew that the other party would be like this. Every time A.I. Lee mentioned going to school, she would play all kinds of tricks. For ten years, A.I. Lee has been using breathing and phagocytosis to improve his physical strength. It is no exaggeration to say that his current combat ability has almost surpassed the existence he knows. Although his arms and legs are normal at the age of 10, he is no different from ordinary people, but his cell strength and viscera strength are far beyond that of human beings. If it is in other places, my body should be regarded as a divine body, right? A.I. Lee compared it. Other countries in memory, such as the Ezoprotos in Esgard and the giants of Jotunheim in Jotunheim, their cells are three times stronger than humans. And I seem to be more than three times. Among them, the most important S cells accounted for almost more than 10%. I don't have combat power evaluation glasses, and I don't know what my current combat power is. Walking to Jin Bing's office on the second floor, A.I. Lee was just about to knock on the door when he heard the conversation inside. The sound insulation effect of this room is absolutely high strength, even if there is a cannon inside, there is no movement outside. But the cell strength is enhanced, and the high intensity sensory A.I. Lee can hear clearly. Jinbin, you're just a gang leader. You pay me to do things and just complete the tasks. Don't think too highly of yourself. He must be killed by me. If you dare to do one more thing, even you and I will be killed. I heard that you like your two sons very much, you should take care of them. A.I. Lee didn't knock on the door, but pushed the door directly and entered. He would like to see who would dare to talk to the underground emperor in New York, his father, whose combat prowess is beyond the charts, and whose human body is at the limit of cultivation. Then, he saw a man standing in front of his father's desk in the room. He wears dark tights on his upper body, black leather pants, and a motorcycle mask on his head. The most noticeable thing is the position of his forehead. There is actually a flying darts target painted on the mask. Afraid that others will not be able to find the bullseye went shooting? Does father like to watch Joker performances recently? He actually invited such a low-level Joker to perform one-on-one? -on -one? A.I. Lee asked Jin Bing with a smile on his face. For a moment, Bullseye's face was dark, and his eyes looked at the ten-year-old kid with anger. Chapter 4 Mysterious Law of Life and Death, Say I in Physique. A.I. Lee, don't talk nonsense, this is the killer I invited. 
Jin Bing's original ugly face dissipated a lot in an instant, and he explained to him with a smile. He definitely knows what kind of personality his son has. Young but wise, irritable but methodical. He didn't think his son would look harmless and understand nothing, thinking that the person opposite was Joker. It is clear that A.I. Lee must have heard something and is deliberately pretending to be an ignorant child to get angry with the other party. Are you a killer? The kind of killer who kills invisible, without touching any leaves? A.I. Lee turned to look at Bullseye and asked. I'm a mercenary. As long as you can afford it, I can even help you kill your father and make you the boss of the gang. Bullseye seemed to be angry at what A.I. Lee had just insulted him, and replied intentionally. That's not necessary, I'm not interested in this position. But if you're a mercenary, can you do everything if I pay you? Definitely, the premise is that you can afford the money. Bullseye replied casually. I should have, some money. A.I. Lee hesitated for a moment and continued to speak. I'll give you 100 million, can you kill the president for me? Bullseye's smile froze, and his whole complexion froze, President. With his strength, he might be discovered if he gets closer. Don't think that the bodyguards around the president are fake. Not enough money? Seeing that he didn't answer, A.I. Lee asked strangely. A little less, Bullseye replied awkwardly. That's right, but I only have 100 million. Can the director kill someone else? Definitely yes, it's just a bureau chief. Tell me, what bureau chief? Bullseye also has self-esteem, he can't kill the president, and he dare not promise. But isn't a director simple? If a child dares to make a sound here, his bullseye is too shameful. In front of Jin Bin, he didn't want his momentum to be suppressed. Nick Fury, director of the Homeland Strategic Defense Offensive and Logistics Agency, is a black one-eyed man. How long does it take to kill a hundred million? HMPH, director of the Logistics Support Bureau? Give me a week. But there must be a deposit. Bullseye snorted coldly. He actually let himself kill a director of the Logistics Support Bureau, he looked down on him too much. It is simply easy to grasp. If it was the chief of the police station, he still felt a little exciting and tricky. I've heard the rules, father, can you transfer him a deposit of 10 million yuan first? No problem, my child, Bullseye, put aside the task I gave you before, and the 20 million will be used as a deposit for this time. Jin didn't know what his son was going to do. Why did he target a bureau chief? But since he asked, he agreed. It's only 20 million US dollars, which is a little bit of water for him. HMPH, Bullseye snorted coldly, then walked to the window and jumped down. What followed was the roar and chasing sounds of several Tibetan mastiffs raised by A.I. Lee in the front yard. Why did you think of asking him to kill a bureau chief? What bad idea do you have? Jin Bing waited for the other party to leave before asking A.I. Lee. It's nothing, it's just that he's upset, A.I. Lee replied casually. Jin didn't know whether the he in A.I. Lee's mouth was upset, whether it was the director or bullseye, but it didn't matter. What do you want me to do? Father, I want to practice and join your organization, A.I. Lee looked at each other seriously. The air froze for a moment, and the atmosphere suddenly became tense. Jin didn't make a sound, and A.I. Lee was also waiting for a reply. Until a sigh. A.I. Lee, you know, your mother doesn't want you to get involved with me. After finishing speaking, seeing that the other party still did not speak, Jin Bing said. You don't want to go to school, do you? Ha 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 ha, I knew my father was very smart, so he followed my roots. A.I. Lee's complexion changed, and he replied with a smile. What? Jin Bing narrowed his eyes, I followed your roots. Ahem, I mean, there are no idiots in the Fisk family. A.I. Lee hastily changed his words. I know you're smart and don't want to learn those things, but your mother talked it over with me. Staring at A.I. Lee's begging expression, Jin Bing had to change his words halfway through. For the last time, you have to go when you are in high school. Thank you, Dad. A.I. Lee was relieved immediately. He is really not interested in going to school with a bunch of little kids, and he can barely accept it in high school. After this matter was settled, A.I. Lee also relaxed and turned to leave. When he opened the door, hesitation paused and spoke to Jin Bing. Father, if you have trouble, you can tell me, you know my strength, I can help you. We are a family. Yes, Dad understands. Jin smiled and nodded. After A.I. Lee closed the door and left, his smile disappeared completely, and he returned to the persona of the underground emperor, with a majestic face and an aura of a strong man. He took out his mobile phone, dialed a number, and said to the person opposite. 
Check it out for me, the Homeland Strategic Defense Offensive and Logistics Agency, and Nick Fury. He knew that his son was not an ordinary child, since he would say this name suddenly, there must be something wrong. Let Bullseye assassinate the opponent, he doesn't think that A.I. Lee will give away 100 million so easily. Wanting to get back the spot for himself, deliberately tricking the Bullseye, how could it be possible for an ordinary bureau chief? He has never paid attention to such a department of the Land Strategic Defense Attack and Logistics Support Bureau. Is there some mystery, Li A.I. who left the office was a little leisurely. Now the trouble of going to school is solved, he has already mastered those courses and knowledge, almost all in his mind. Going to school to play house with a group of ten-year-olds, A.I. Lee will really be bored to death. Cool. Breathing out a mouthful of stagnation, practicing twenty-four hours of full-powered breathing, A.I. Lee's body is improving all the time. But he was a little dissatisfied without knowing the specific strength. Before he was ten years old, he had been restraining his progress to prevent his physical development from being too exaggerated. And now it's time to move on to the next step. The foundation has been laid, and the real blowout improvement begins. Fighting is the most critical ability, and A.I. Lee knows that strength is the last word in this world. You have gained insight into the deep-seated mysteries of life through long-term accumulation of actual combat experience. With the cooperation of S-cells, you have an epiphany, created the mystery law of life and death. Mystery law of life and death, in the battle with all your strength, after dying and resurrecting, the combat power will be doubled. Chapter 5 Marvel Exclusive Foundation Building Medicinal Bath Finally come. A.I. Lee has been fighting with Papa's men all these years. At the beginning, he was not used to the way of fighting, and those people were worried about hurting A.I. Lee, so they didn't use all their strength. But with the help of heaven-defying understanding, all fighting methods were quickly mastered by him. These days, A.I. Lee has also learned countless fighting techniques, each of which he has integrated into his own experience. At the age of ten, he is already considered a master of fighting. As long as the fighting skills can be found, they are all within the learning scope of A.I. Lee. Judo, Muay Thai, Ji Eat Gyun Do, Karate, Gracie Jiu Jitsu, Israeli fighting technique, Russian Sambo, Aikido, Sanda. As long as it is familiar to the ear, A.I. Lee will not let it go. He has a heaven-defying understanding, and he has completely mastered it almost after observation and deduction. To put it bluntly, the imitation master may be a small party in front of him. After all A.I. Lee besides these fighting skills, his strength is not fake either. With the same punch, if you hit me, you will only pat your clothes in disdain. If I punch you, you will die. How does this work, master imitation? Unless you can imitate my strength. Boom. I punched the sandbag in the basement draining base. This is a custom-made sandbag. In fact, it should not be called this name, because it is solid. But under A.I. Lee's punch, it directly turned into pieces. Some distress. A.I. Lee can't find suitable training equipment now, how can I practice because everything can be broken with a single punch? We still have to fight. Although all you can meet now are small party dishes, it's better than practicing against these machines. A.I. Lee looked at these machines, and said helplessly. If it doesn't work, then go to study the gravity chamber, the general direction is the super gravity increasing device of centrifugal force. This requires him to study subsequent mechanics courses. It's too troublesome, it's not as convenient as researching new exercises. After all, the focus of the gravity room is to increase the strength of your physical body. And it's enough to create a physical strength method. Ai Li's eyes lit up, and he immediately had a goal for the next thing. To improve the strength of the body, starting from the cells, the S cells have the blessing of breathing, coupled with the cooperation of the moonlight Bruce spectrum, the basic speed is enough. The rest. Nutrition solution. Whether it is the legendary medicated bath or the more popular scientific nutrient solution in the West, it is a way to soak the body to improve physical strength. A.I. Lee turned round and started to study these things. Fortunately, A.I. Lee's understanding is against the sky and the speed of learning Chinese medicine is simply amazing. Coupled with the full level of comprehension, and being silent in the ocean of medical knowledge, the effect is also obvious after more than a month. You have learned the knowledge of traditional Chinese medicine, constantly comprehend it, combine it with Western science and medicine, and integrate it, you have an epiphany. You have created Foundation Establishment Medicinal Bath. Building Foundation Medicine Bath, after soaking, 
It can strengthen the body's cell activity, remove dark wounds, and eliminate impurities in the body. Done. A prescription was determined by A. I. Lee, and he was sure that the effect of this thing would be absolutely fine. That night, A. I. Lee collected all the medicinal materials and tested them himself. His original S cells have reached a terrifying level, and because of the breathing method, there are not so many impurities in the body. But even so, the color at the potion still changed after soaking, which was obviously the result of the impurities being discharged. Feeling the difference in himself, A. I. Lee felt that his strength seemed to be a little stronger. In addition, hearing and vision have improved. The strength of the body has been further improved, and the effect of soaking for a long time and multiple times will definitely be better. After thinking for a while, A. I. Lee decided to give Vanessa and Jin both his medicinal bath. If it wasn't for them, I might have died on the side of the road. Even if he doesn't die, the messy hell's kitchen will definitely have a hard time being picked up by others. How could it be possible to be like this now, to be well clothed and well fed since childhood? The grace of saving lives is true, A. I. Lee also regards them as his own parents, so why should he hold back from them, things that can make them better, A. I. Lee doesn't seem to hide them. If you don't even want to do these things, why bother to be a human being? Wouldn't it be better to be a beast who doesn't understand anything? Even if it is a beast, crows still know how to feed back. With the medicine bath prescription, Ai Li walked towards Jin Bing's office. At the same time, let the maid call her mother Vanessa. What? You created a medicinal bath formula? Jin Bing was stunned for a long time after hearing Ai Li's words. He knew about medicinal baths. In fact, many families will use it, especially some killer organizations prefer this thing. Jin Bing is also involved, but most of them are not very useful. He was a little surprised to hear that his son had made a medicated bath. That's right, father, I have personally experienced this medicated bath. In addition to improving physical fitness and eliminating impurities, it can also heal previous dark wounds. These words caused Jin Bing's eyes to widen, and heal the hidden wounds. He has worked hard and fought with people for so many years, and there are indeed many injuries in his body, and after many years of accumulation, he is often troubled. Can. Is it reliable? Thinking of the wisdom and ability that A. I. Lee has shown over the years, Jin felt that what the other party said should not be a lie. In that case, let's try. Vanessa on the side stared at Jin Bin with great interest, and he believed it. In Vanessa's opinion, this is simply a fantasy. Taking a bath can heal the body and strengthen the body. But seeing her husband and son starting to mess around, Vanessa didn't question her. No matter what, even if it's fake. It's not bad to let the father and son make trouble together and deepen their relationship. After all, Vanessa felt a little sorry for A. I. Lee. Since she had a son with Jin, she felt that she paid less attention to A. I. Lee. Jin Bing is also very busy with gang affairs, so he can't take care of A. I. Lee. Vanessa's guilt is obviously getting deeper and deeper, and it's really good for the family to have some trouble together this time. This kind of thinking made Vanessa cooperate with their father and son to make a medicated bath. But after the soak, Vanessa realized that the medicated bath made by her son was real. Ah! Screams rang out in the villa, causing the guards to startle, thinking that someone was raiding. I, my skin. Vanessa looked at her skin getting better in the mirror, like white jade, and fainted with excitement. Jin Bin rolled his eyes. What he cared about was his physical strength and previous injuries, and he didn't have time to realize it. My wife is so excited because her skin has gotten better. But looking at Vanessa with better skin and perfect waist, Jin swallowed her saliva. The long-term gang affairs have kept him from getting close to women for a long time. After the medicinal bath, he felt a little hot. Vanessa, called softly, Jin stood up from the water and walked towards his wife. Chapter 6 I don't know, I'm just a gatekeeper. These two are really interested. A. I. Lee was waiting outside the door for them to finish their medicinal bath, discussing the next matters. If it was just Jin Bin, he would have been waiting inside. But if my mother is there, it's not appropriate. Unexpectedly, after waiting, seeing that the time was almost up, and they were about to call them out, the sound of Zitheran singing could be heard inside. Beyond ordinary people, A. I. Lee could feel the corners of his mouth twitching, he turned round and picked up his younger brother Richard and walked out of the house to the outer courtyard. You won't have more younger brothers, will you? A. I. Lee joked, teasing Richard's apple muscles. It's thanks to you this time. Jin Bin said with a smile on his face, this is the time when he is in the best mood during this period. 
The moment he came out of the water, he found that his body was more relaxed. In the past, because I hadn't become the boss yet, the injuries left by fighting at the bottom level were cured, but there were always some that couldn't be healed, such as the scars on the bones. But now when he does some movements like before, the pain is obviously much less. Jin Bing understands that it is impossible to heal himself completely with a medicated bath, and it is already astonishing to have such a good effect. And this is all thanks to the blessing of his adopted son, A. I. Lee. At this moment, Jin felt that when Vanessa hugged the other party and said that she wanted to adopt him, it was really an extremely correct decision. When I came out of the church, I met A. I. Lee. Maybe the other party was really given to me by God. As the boss of a gangster, with such a child, he really doesn't know what God thinks. It is precisely because of his career that Jin cherishes his family very much. Whether it's A. I. Lee who was adopted first, or Richard who was born with Vanessa later. I see that you have been a little busy recently. It seems that there is some difficulty. What's the matter? Something went wrong with the gang. A. I. Lee couldn't help asking. Jin Bing was very busy during this time, even busier than before. It shouldn't be. He is already the boss of Hell's Kitchen, and his influence has radiated to the whole New York. Step by step nibbling, it won't be long before New York will have a second talker. No reason why this time is busier than before. Something went wrong. Jin Bin replied. Kim wasn't surprised that his ten-year-old son was talking to him like that. Because he thinks A.I. Lee is a genius, and it's normal to be a bit more mature. It's been like this since childhood. Speaking of which, last time you asked Bullseye to assassinate the chief. Jin Bin raised his head and stared at him, with a puzzled look in his eyes. What's the origin of that Nick Fury? What happened to Bullseye? Not to mention this, A. I. Lee was forgotten, as if he really didn't hear the news of Bullseye, and was a little curious. He found an opportunity on the street and directly assassinated the opponent, but he didn't expect that a bureau chief would be equipped with all kinds of weapons. Jin Bing raised his brows tightly together, until now he still finds it a bit unbelievable. He has a heavy machine gun and a grenade gun in his car, and the car is even equipped with a missile launcher. Damn it, you can't imagine that just as Bullseye is about to make a move, and rebounds the game will hit you. One arm was broken, and then he ran away. Now he has been designated as an S-rank wanted criminal who is still being hunted down, and has it abroad. Hearing this, A.I. Lee couldn't help laughing out loud, really thought 20 million would be easy to get? No, it's not that the task was not completed, and 20 million was given to the other party. The money came back, but he didn't complete the task, so the deposit will naturally be returned. He has a mercenary organization affiliated with him. Jin Bing knew what he was thinking when he saw A. I. Lee's face. Swallowing money from Jin Bing? Sorry, no one in New York has dared to do that yet. Don't underestimate the boss of a gangster, especially the underground emperor of New York. Everyone has secrets, A. I. Lee, you are a genius. You have your own ideas. But remember, we are a family. If you have any difficulties, please tell us. Your mother and I never regarded you as an adopted child. Remember one thing. A. I. Lee listened to Jin Bing's indoctrination of the old routine again, and took over the other party's words. A truly intelligent person never puts himself in a dangerous position. That's right. Jin was not satisfied that A. I. Lee took his words to heart. After leaving Dad's office, A. I. Lee remembered about the medicine bath. Forget it. An existence like Jin Bing is not the boss of a child's playhouse. The other party can go this far, I really think the IQ will be low. I'm afraid that the matter of the medicinal bath has been prepared in the first place, and there is no need for him to mention it. However, the sudden change of subject still made A.I. Lee find something wrong with Jin. He was worried about meddling in his affairs. Is it because my mother doesn't want to get involved in the underworld, or because Jin is worried about his safety? Randomly found a subordinate responsible for guarding the safety of the villa, and A. I. Lee waved him to the training room on the second basement floor. After realizing that she was the one chosen, Karen straightened her back and walked over with a generous face. The other hands around him didn't move their faces, but their eyes shifted to watch his steps, and they were happy in their hearts. Who doesn't know that if you fight with the young master A. I. Lee, you will be beaten badly? Although there are a lot of training subsidies after the end, the pain is really painful. What bad things happened in the gang recently? It affected my father. Just when he took off his suit and was ready to meet the young master's fist, he was startled when he heard this question, and stood there staring blankly at A. I. Lee. Not a fight? Then there is no allowance. No, this cannot be answered. If the boss finds out, he will be miserable. I don't know, I'm just a gatekeeper. 
Karen pretended not to understand anything, with a confused look on her face. It's a pity that you don't go to the Oscars, A.I. Lee said with a cold face, and asked again, give you another chance, what happened? Have no idea? The subordinates who can guard round the villa are the core members of the gang. In addition to being strong and professionally trained, everyone. They are also entitled to know many things. Don't say? Seeing that the other party still didn't speak, A.I. Lee understood that he was afraid that his father would be bigger than himself. He casually walked to a dumbbell, and he casually held a 50 kilograms discus in his hand. Click. The discus was grabbed by A.I. Lee with both hands and squeezed in, and after a few times it turned into a shot put. Gurgling. The corners of Karen's mouth twitched several times, and the sweat on his forehead began to drip down. Chapter 7 The Punisher? Why are you staring at Hell's Kitchen? Seven tenths. So you said that? Boss. The situation is pressing. Karen dared not swallow his saliva, facing Jin Bin's eyes. I can only move my eyes to the irregular shot put on the side. Seeing his dodging eyes, Jin Bin also looked at the shot put, then walked up and grabbed it with one hand and lifted it up. Karen stiffened at the sight. This family is really terrifying. The son squeezed the discus into a shot put when he was ten years old, and the father picked up a 100 gin shot put with one hand to play with. How did you practice? Get the punishment yourself. Jin Bin said. Karen was shocked and received the penalty. This punishment is very simple, cut off a finger. Why, my words don't work anymore. Seeing that he was not moving, Jin Bin glanced at him sternly. With his eyes, Karen only felt that his body was stared at by a ferocious beast, and the cold sweat on his back had overflowed, and his clothes were all wet. Will die. No, the young master wanted me to give something to the boss before he left. Karen hurriedly took out a piece of paper from her pocket and handed it over. Jin Bing opened it and smiled after twitching the corners of his mouth. Okay, from now on you will be in charge of A.I. Lee's affairs and follow him. It's fine if you are punished but there will be no salary for a year. R? Yes, Karen responded hastily, turned round and walked towards the door, and escaped. Salary? That's a fart, he has made a lot of money following the boss all these years, and if he doesn't have any money for a year, it won't affect his normal life. But today's experience made Karen seem to have gone through a roller coaster. Good guy, he was threatened by two people, father and son, within an hour. One is the threat of power suppression, and the other is mental oppression. Jin didn't care about his departure at all, and threw the note on his desk. Irene told him not to punish the other party, obviously knowing that she would know about it. His eyes fell on the shot put. Jin Bin lifted it up and squeezed it a few times. The shot put with no rules began to shape shifting, and finally returned to the original discus shape, but it was a little uneven. It was easily squeezed into a ball. A.I. Lee, how strong is your strength now? Jin was a little curious. It took a while to get this thing by himself, and he tried his best. In Karen's report just now, his son made it like this lightly. I still underestimate your strength, my son is such a genius. Follow me. As the adoptive father of the other party, Jin Bing would not say that his son is a monster. Therefore, genius on A.I. Lee is his favorite adjective. Is it over there? A.I. Lee stood on the roof of a building in the dark, wearing a simple pullover to hide his face. Although he was only ten years old. His body was strengthened, and he was much taller than his peers, reaching 1.6 meters. The role of the pullover is to make others see him, and they won't think he is a 10-year-old kid, but think he is a short young man. He came out after getting information from Karen. Punisher. This name is the existence of some fame in Hell's Kitchen recently. A man who is doing things everywhere calls himself the Punisher. No one knows his purpose, but he is targeting gangsters and gangsters. Among them. Jin Bin is the largest gang here, so naturally it is targeted. Several flower factories were destroyed, and many of their men were killed by the opponent. Just like his nickname, The Punisher, the opponent doesn't keep his hands like Spider-Man, but kills with one blow, leaving no one alive. Frank Castle. A.I. Lee didn't know much about this character, and began to search for this person's information in the memory palace in his mind. A soldier from the U.S. Marine Corps, he served as a military training instructor after retiring from the army. When having dinner with his wife and children in the park, a family of four was brutally shot and killed by gangsters on the spot because they witnessed a gangster lynching incident. The gangsters escaped the sanction with various channels and loopholes in the law. Frank, who was completely desperate for justice, wanted to avenge his wife and children. 
decided to seek justice for his wife and children in his own way, and adopted methods of killing all criminals without pardon. In this way, the other party seems to be a good person, punishing rape and eliminating evil. But unfortunately, I'm not a good person, A.I. Lee sighed. If in a previous life, ordinary people's A.I. Lee would definitely give him a thumbs up silently, and also kindly call him the light of the city. But. This is Marvel, not past life. And he is not a good person. On the first day of crossing, to be precise, it should be the first time when I was adopted by Jin. A.I. Lee feels that as a flower grower, I want to clear obstacles for the motherland. Then with Pranayama, his mind changed. I'm from Earth. I want to protect my Earth. And now, A.I. Lee feels that he needs to change his mind again. I even grinned and carried rice. I am God. Definitely, A.I. Lee is very clear that his current strength has not yet reached this stage. But the difference in vision makes his attitude towards things different. Home is his current fetter, and Jinbin is a thread in this fetter. Now that you Punisher are making the thread tremble, I'm going to stabilize these and the make the thread calm again. Punisher? Even if you are the king of gods, I will clear the obstacles in the way. Based on your comprehension of qi, combined with powerful energy, you have an epiphany. You understand the use of qi. This is a new understanding that A.I. Lee got a few months ago. The use of qi, like the kin dragon ball, can perceive other people's qi. However, this qi is not a detection of Kai Gong, but a judgment of a person's spirit and spirit. For example, the father Jin Bing. His qi is many times stronger than ordinary people, A.I. Lee directly remembers it in his heart after getting acquainted with it. Somewhat similar to combat power measurement glasses, but not as accurate. The entire Hell's Kitchen was in his perception, and he quickly found several relatively powerful qi. Exclude a few existences, such as Jin Bin, such as a few masters in the gang, and the remaining one should be the Punisher. And the other party is now cautiously approaching a flower processing factory. Obviously, his goal today is to solve this factory. A.I. Lee jumped directly from the tall building, and moved forward quickly after the whole body fell to the ground. Every time one leg kicks the ground, the body leaves the string like a sharp arrow. It disappeared from the spot in the blink of an eye, even if someone noticed it, they would think it was a strong wind blowing by. I don't know why. That's it. The Punisher Frank moved a little bit. Standing at an optimal attack point tens of meters away from the factory without being discovered. Set up the rifle in your hand, wait for the people inside to come out, and start a wave of shooting, and then. Does it look good? Suddenly, a voice sounded from Frank's side. Chapter 7 of the new book asks for flowers, asks for monthly tickets, and asks for evaluation tickets. Please support me and continue to update. Chapter 8 Get rid of the Punisher, the lack of memory palace 8 tenths. Who? This sound scared Frank so much that he almost peed out. It took him a long time to find this location, and he also made sure that there was no one around. He was just concentrating on preparing to attack, when suddenly a voice came from his ear, and the other party was very casual, how could he be calm? He hurriedly stood up and tried to pull out his exclusive 9mm Browning automatic pistol from his waist. I felt a huge force coming from my waist, as if I was hit by a locomotive and flew backwards boom. Hitting the wall, Frank felt that his body no longer belonged to him. As an experienced unconventional warfare specialist, he is familiar with conventional medical skills. I knew my situation right away, my ribs were broken, and two of them were almost inserted into my spleen. His right hand was broken, and his left leg was completely distorted by the impact to a weird degree, and he lost consciousness. In one fell swoop, he became a useless person. Dread dread. Footsteps sounded. Frank raised his spirits and looked over, and saw the figure of A.I. Lee approaching. The hood was lifted to reveal his face, and A.I. Lee looked at him curiously. This kind of guy is just like the city soldier king, which makes people feel incredible. A special veteran who has received countless medals, even the presidential badge of freedom. Able to specialize in individual team tactics, fighting, fighting, shooting, underwater operations, extorting confessions, intelligence gathering, etc., etc. He is proficient in all kinds of firearms, his combat weapons are not fixed, and he can shoot a dagger as a blade, and there are no mistakes within 20 meters. Xiao Li was flying darts skills. It is military experts who can make thermal weapons, and medical experts who can treat all trauma. Almighty, okay? Except for the urban soldier king, such a person can only be produced by American blockbusters. I'm curious, 
Is it true that as long as you have experience in the Marine Corps, you are invincible? A.I. Lee asked the other party. You, you are, Jinbin's son? Frank wants to target Jinbing's gang, and definitely investigated the other party. It's not that A.I. Lee doesn't leave the gate and doesn't go out, the photo is also there with the other party. But he never expected that the opponent's strength was so terrifying that. Not human at all. One strike, just a whip kick can beat him like this, this kind of guy is a personal combat weapon. Subconsciously, Frank thought of Captain America during World War II. I am afraid that the other party is similar to Captain America. Yeah, the information is quite complete, so don't you know that my further Jin Bing's personal strength is also good? A.I. Lee was surprised that the other party could recognize him, a little surprised. Then asked curiously. It's really annoying, you can investigate so much, don't you know that your strength is also vulnerable to my father? Do you really think you are strong? Jumping around every day, that is, my father doesn't want to end up fighting against fleas like you in person. If he is inferior, he would have killed you long ago. Puff. Listening to the other party comparing himself to a flea, Frank spat out a mouthful of blood. I don't know if he was angry or if he was seriously injured and dying. A. Ali is actually just teasing him, and beating him is indeed the same as beating his son. No, it sounds like dad would beat himself. It was Jin who beat him like beating his grandson, completely crushing him, but Jin couldn't find this mouse, he was elusive and refused to show up, and he had professional anti-tracking. And he never kept alive and did not reveal his face, so no one knew what he looked like. Because of this, Jin Bin, who is obviously powerful, is troubled all day because of the Punisher. He he. Daddy is a gang leader. Son. Son is also a bastard. Panting heavily, Frank stared at A.I. Lee with hatred and said sarcastically. TCH, do you know how many jobs my dad brought to New York? A.I. Lee looked at him disdainfully, what is the connection between right and wrong? He is not a sentimental, bright and optimistic protagonist of the second dimension Madonna. A.I. Lee thinks that he should be regarded as, an ancestor character? When raising the horizon beyond the earth, the entire universe, and zooming in on the timeline of the multi-universe, he no longer cares about gangsters or gangsters. A.I. Lee doesn't want to see any disgusting pictures. So he decided to be clean, walked to the side and reached out to grab the wall pier, and lifted it up with a snap. Then approached Frank step by step. With wide-eyed eyes, Frank felt that he had seen a ghost. How could this wall pier weigh several tons? This guy held it with one hand. Then with a horrified expression, he discovered that the other party was going to attack him. Wait, do you know how many bad things your father has done? You should be an Englishman with this ability. Boom. Take off in three steps and then hit a slam dunk directly. The huge amounts of sound caused the sirens of many old-fashioned cars in the night, and even the people in the flour mill realized that something was wrong, and hurriedly took up weapons and ran out. Frank was photographed as a pancake, but A.I. Lee couldn't see it. He killed the opponent in this way just to make it less disgusting. Otherwise, how ugly would it be to get blood all over by accident? The clean A.I. Lee jumped up on the spot and left the scene of the accident. He didn't make a sound until the people from the factory came out. Tell Kim and Punisher is dead, don't worry about his problems. The people in the factory only saw a black shadow jumping away, and the other person was wearing a hood and couldn't see his face clearly. Immediately dialed their online numbers in a hurry, and then reported layer by layer. Their existence is not entitled to know Jin Bing's number. Not long after, Jin Bing left home and rushed here. The Punisher Frank. Who else? Neighborhood hero Spider-Man. Who else has anything to do with Hell's Kitchen? After returning home, A.I. Lee took a shower and sorted out the mood of the first murder. After recovering almost, he began to study his memory. Traveling to this world for ten years, to be honest, many things will be slowly forgotten with time. At most, some big events can be kept in his mind. But it's not what he wants. How can you be indifferent if you can be the prophet of the plot? My memory palace is still not enough, and the memory stored in a simple memory palace will slowly dissipate, and my mental power. Thinking of this aspect, A.I. Lee has always focused on the strength of the physical body, but forgot the improvement of the spiritual aspect. Mental power is also a force that cannot be ignored in Marvel. Chapter 9 The idea of refining gods and meditation, we are also a student, nine-tenths. Mental power affects too many things. Resistance to sound waves, resistance to illusion. Defense against magic that affects the mind. Even practicing magic may be related to spiritual power. 
After all, magicians so astral, oh, that is, the astral projection used by their magician seems to be the embodiment of spiritual power. Therefore, this thing is still very necessary. Wanting to understand this, A. I. Lee immediately started research on spiritual power. There is a house of gold in the book, and knowledge is what everyone wishes for. A. I. Lee believes in this, even if the content they learn is written by others, but integrating everyone's cognition is what A. I. Lee needs to do. And the next step is to use the heaven-defying understanding to continue to improve these cognitions. Spiritual power is actually a kind of magnetic field. This kind of magnetic field only exists in intelligent life forms, and the higher the level of the life form, the stronger the spiritual power. This is a bit of a statement. A. I. Lee studied for a while with a theology book he just bought, and found a reliable saying. At least this is the most similar. Everything that exists in the universe is conserved, it will not disappear or appear out of thin air, so from the perspective of conservation, spiritual power is a tangible existence, but human beings are currently invisible and intangible. Mankind's large-scale and high-intensity attention will act on the material space and cause the material to move in a regular manner. In layman's terms, it means that human spiritual power can directly change the material reality, but this change is very, very small. Only through extremely meticulous only statistics and calculations can be found that the combined spiritual power of all human beings has almost negligible impact on reality. Hey, it's interesting. This theory, A. I. Lee looked at the book unexpectedly. It was well written, and he originally thought it was fabricated by a magician, but with so many contents mixed together. Looks like this guy has a bit of knowledge, and seems to. He knows how to cultivate spiritual power? A. I. Lee guessed suspiciously and then looked at the title page of the book. Author, Tilda Swinton. Okay, I don't know. However, it was of great help to him. A. I. Lee immediately continued to read books. Knowledge is the last word of all foundations. No matter how amazing my ability is, and what kind of understanding is against the sky, it is impossible to become a doctor from ignorance. Only with enough basic knowledge can you break through more difficult problems. This is the same as cultivation. Only when the foundation is strong enough can there be greater progress in breaking through. Based on your understanding of mental mechanics, combined with S cells to master the inner vision ability, you have an epiphany, created S cell alchemy meditation method. S cell refining meditation method, meditate in your mind, exercise your own spiritual power, use S cells as the basis to communicate with your soul, temper your own spirit, and strengthen your soul structure. It's still related to the soul. A. I. Lee frowned, feeling a little annoyed about the soul. The existence of spiritual power is special, it is enough to be explained by science, and it is something he can understand now. Because of this, he was able to realize this idea of meditation. But the soul is different. The soul is a pseudo-scientific subject standing in the known science, and it is also something that human beings cannot get involved at present. It is too difficult for A. I. Lux to comprehend this thing simply by relying on his current understanding, and it may take many years. For the past ten years, A. I. Lee has been forging his own body, from cells to viscera to bones. Every part is being polished, and with the effect of the medicinal bath, his current strength has reached a terrifying level. With a pure physical body, he doesn't think anyone can compete with him on earth. In recent years, what A. I. Lee has started to study is his own spiritual power. Definitely did not let go of the physical body, but the breathing method has become his full power exercise, as long as he is breathing, he will keep improving. There is no need to take the initiative to control the cultivation of the subconscious mind. The forging of mental power also greatly strengthens A. I. Lee's memory ability. In addition to simply refining his own spiritual power for subsequent practice, A. I. Lee has also built his own memory kingdom. Yes, memory kingdom. Another's is a palace, his is a kingdom. The effect of the memory palace is to virtualize your brain into a space for storing information, similar to a computer hard disk. Then classify the characteristics of each room, just like folders in a computer. In fact, to put it bluntly, it is a coding and processing method. But a normal person, to be precise, a genius is to classify the necessary and important content, after all, not all of these memories are needed. But A.I. Lee is different, he has completely turned his memory into a huge database, while others are computer hard drives, he is an entire server. My virtual self stands in front of the kingdom in my mind. On the left is the knowledge he learned, and the palace door post above says mathematics, mechanics and theology. On the right is his experience, important things, accidents experienced. And in the central main hall, when A.I. Lee walked into it, 
The first thing that appeared was a display screen. Iron Man Hulk Avengers 1 Galaxy. After opening each one, there are different screens. The Avengers Alliance movie he had watched flickered in the past. A.I. Lee felt that he was very necessary, so he put it in the main hall. Walking inside, A.I. Lee stopped at the main seat of the palace, which was supposed to be a throne, but now it turned into a computer chair. He walked up with a smile, sat on it casually, the scene in front of him was reversed, and what appeared was his experience in his previous life. That's right, A.I. Lee put all these memories of her previous life here to remind her of her existence. He wants to remind himself that he is a time traveler. Otherwise, he is worried that if one day his existence can really surpass the gods, or reach the stage of the gods, in the blink of an eye, he will forget his past in tens of millions of years. After all, how many people will remember the memories of thousands of years ago? A. I. Lee, A. I. Lee. Don't delay, you know what day it is. There was a shout outside the door, everything in front of A. I. Lee's eyes began to be false, and then slowly dissipated, and he opened his eyes, and he returned to the bedroom. Hearing the urging voice outside the door, A.I. Lee stood up and answered. Got it mom, here I come. At 1.85 meters, he was much taller than himself a few years ago. Vanessa stroked his hair already requiring him to bend down to cooperate. Congratulations A.I. Lee, you are about to enter your high school career, let's work hard. Okay, I will work hard. A.I. Lee really wants to tell him that he has finished all his university courses, even a university professor may not be as good as himself. But, it's clear that Vanessa desperately wants him to go to school. Except for the old friend's flowers, is there really only one flower gone? The monthly ticket is also zero, please support me, I've added ten more chapters. Chapter 10 Sudden Enlightenment and Chi Training. School Daily, 10 tenths. Midtown High School is a well-known high school on the west bank of Manhattan. It may be because the Clint area is commonly known as West Midtown, so the name of this high school is also Midtown High. A.I. Lee arrived outside the school in a car and asked Karen to drive away. Since Jin and his father asked him to follow him a few years ago, Karen has taken care of most of the things around him. Not bad, the efficiency of the other party's work is quite high. Karen can solve any request as soon as possible as long as it is reasonable so he is also happy that the other party follows him, which saves him a lot of time. Playing hooky, A.I. Lee subconsciously thought of this movie. It's just that Zook Sing Sing in it came back to school when he was old, but he traveled to another world, and his age really became younger. Is the plot of pretending to be aggressive coming? To be honest, A.I. Lee likes this kind of plot a little bit, after all, this thing is rarely encountered. In the past, when I traveled by myself, there were people behind me, whether it was buying a car or shopping. The cold and contemptuous expression of the salesperson has never appeared on them. They are afraid of being beaten, and they can see that their followers are not simple. It's really a pity. But this time going to school alone, isn't this an opportunity? All the student status issues have been resolved, and the school teacher also sent a questionnaire for the entrance examination. After answering the questions online, he confirmed that his knowledge was okay, and he passed quickly. So go straight into it, A. I. Lee is a transfer student in the third year of high school. Since my mother wants to be a student and satisfy her desire to be able to hold parent-teacher meetings, A. I. Lee tries to satisfy her as much as possible. But the three-year high school is a bit exaggerated, and the first year of high school is almost the same. Class C, your class. The guard pointed to the direction when he saw the notice, and let him enter the school by himself. He didn't enter the school with everyone, so when he came, many classrooms were still in class. After A.I. Lee went to the teaching office and found the director, he was taken to class C. After going through a series of processes, writing names on the blackboard and introducing myself, they were arranged in the penultimate row by the window. A.I. Lee didn't pay attention to the questions on the blackboard at a glance, and the simple mathematical equations could already see the answer at a glance. Turning her head to look out of the window, A.I. Lee's mind also let go. A gaze from the side caught his attention, and he turned around to see a blonde girl. Foreign girls mature relatively early, at least A.I. Lee didn't see any shadow of high school students in each other. With a smile, A.I. Lee continued to look out the window. It's not that he's pretending, but... He really didn't have much interest in this ordinary girl. With his physique, he lost the opponent before rushing a few times. Then it is very likely to beg for mercy. In the end, the other party fainted before I finished. Playing with dead bodies? What a fart. A.I. Lee admires Vegeta very much for this. Bulma has never practiced before. 
when an ordinary body is doing things, if Vegeta gets excited. Be good, even if it doesn't kill someone. A.I. Lee also gave birth to a son trance, and A.I. Lee suspects that Vegeta may not have experienced what is cool. Like, is it him? Gwen looked curiously at the Asian student who had just transferred, because this person was very similar to the person she met. But since I didn't see the face, I'm not sure. Can. The sixth sense told her that it was this A.I. Lee. A woman's sixth sense is sometimes very accurate. When Gwen was staring at A.I. Lee, there was also a man in the first group staring at Gwen, with a look of displeasure in his eyes. Good guy, the feeling of a love triangle appeared at once. It's just that A.I. Lee doesn't know this at all, otherwise he would definitely be a little excited. A day's class is like a boring playhouse. A.I. Lee sits on the seat all day, basically meditating to understand what he needs. It's no different from being at home. After school, go home. Then A.I. Lee wraps up her first day of school, led by mom Vanessa. Brother, is school fun? Before it was too late, his younger brother Richard slipped into his room and began to ask. Richard, who is about to enter elementary school, is very concerned about this matter. In order not to dampen his younger brother's curiosity, A.I. Lee decided to deceive him kindly, telling him about the benefits of the school and the fun of countless friends. He was sure that if he said school was boring, five minutes later Vanessa would be rushing in and firing on him. Your cognition of Chi is getting more and more precise. With the improvement of spiritual power and the forging of cell structure, you understand the essence of Chi, you have an epiphany, created Chi training method. Chi practicing method, to enhance the spiritual energy produced by one's own breathing exercise, strengthening one's own Chi can improve strength in all aspects. When A.I. Lee comprehended, a piece of good news came, and his comprehension entered a deeper level again. Chi, a means that A.I. Lee has been comprehending. The Chi researched by A.I. Lee before was always almost meaningless, because he thought that Chi was a stream of energy, a physical ability developed by the strong, such as the use of Kaigong waves. But when he comprehended the S. Cell God refining meditation method a few years ago and started to practice spiritual power, he found something was wrong. Because ordinary people have never practiced before, they don't even know the existence of Chi, but there is Chi in their bodies. Why? When A.I. Lee gradually understood after spiritual training, the real Chi is the energy of the body. More scientifically speaking, it is the biological energy of the human body. The human body produces heat, and the generation of heat is realized through the biochemical reactions of the human body. The food we eat, the water we drink, and the air we breathe are all undergoing chemical reactions. Our digestive system can decompose and synthesize these nutrients into the molecules we need, and these molecules are transported along the blood to cells throughout the body. These cells are the processing plants of energy. Ali's chi is created by the cells, and the S cells brought him a more concentrated chi. He releases these energies, which is the so-called Kaigong wave. Ordinary people can't do it because they don't use this energy. And some other species can do it, such as the electric eel, whose body can generate electricity that can reach 300 volts to 800 volts of high voltage. The improvement of qi depends on the blessing of cell ability and mental power, so the focus is back to the strength of the physical body and the strength of mental power. Sure enough, I made the right choice at the beginning. There is absolutely no problem in taking the road of A.I. Lee. The next day, A.I. Lee, who got up early, went to school according to the daily arrangement, but today he found something was wrong. Be careful. An international student from Arsan touched him lightly as he walked by him. Then slip away quickly. Ten chapters here. Please support the flowers. Chapter 11 The Plot of the Old American Drama, One Tenth. Is this worrying about me, or threatening me? A.I. Lee watched Xiao Pao leaving in a daze. Worry about your own words. The two of them had no intersection at all, even this Arsan wasn't in his class, so why did they kindly remind them? If it's a threat, it's even more unlikely. The character of the other party is obviously that kind of fearful. In fact, A.I. Lee also noticed something was wrong. Because from the moment he stepped into the campus, many people around him paid attention to his appearance and looked at him. Don't think that he is worthy of attention just because he is a transfer student. There are at least 500 people in the entire Zongqing High School. It is not surprising that there is one more transfer student, and it is not reported by the whole school. So these people must care about themselves, but they didn't do anything yesterday, what is there to pay attention to? Without knowing why, Ai Li went directly to her own locker, which is something that every student has their own. Hey Peter, how was yesterday? 
Ai Li noticed that the people around him were also making things, so he couldn't help but take the initiative to communicate. The other party is his classmate, Peter Parker. That's right, that's Spider-Man Peter Parker. Ai Li was a little surprised when he learned that the other party was his classmate. But he is still an ordinary person, wearing glasses, apparently not stung by a spider. It's okay. Peter Parker didn't expect this transfer student to know him, and they didn't communicate with each other yesterday, so he stammered in surprise. Don't worry so much, I just want to meet new classmates. Seeing his stuttering appearance, A.I. Lee couldn't help laughing. A.I. Lee, right? Peter Parker recalled his self-introduction yesterday and remembered the name. Then, he thought of something, and his face changed slightly to remind him. Boom. Before Peter could speak, there was a huge amount of slamming on the door from the other side. Turning his head around strangely, A.I. Lee saw a male student standing beside him, holding the closet door next to him with one hand, looking at him arrogantly. He was 1.8 meters tall and a little shorter than himself, wearing a football jacket and a red peaked cap, and the teasing on his face was not concealed at all. This is the image, the image of the school bully in the standard American school drama. Beside him, there were several people chewing gum while laughing and watching. One of the BLCK men was wearing a fake chunky gold necklace. Why is it fake? Because it is so thick, and with the strength of this thin black man, he might become a hunchback if he wears it on his body. How can it be so easy? White skin, Japan? Korea? Thompson asked A.I. Lee jokingly while chewing gum. Thompson, don't do this, he is our classmate. Peter Parker had some hesitation, but finally stood up and stood in front of A.I. Lee, and said to him. Ha ha ha, stop kidding Peter Parker, are you trying to help him get ahead, weak chicken? Thompson laughed straight away. With Peter Parker's height of 1.6 meters and his thin body, standing in front of this tall Thompson who is 1.8 meters tall, he is indeed a little thin. Peter, A.I. Lee stretched out his hand to pull him, and gave him a look of nothing. Be careful, you are a transfer student and you are of Chinese descent, you will be bullied, Peter whispered beside A.I. Lee when he was pulled over. Understood. A.I. Lee understood now, it turned out that it was because of her own skin and the attribute of a transfer student. His complexion turned pale. Does this count as racial discrimination? What a joke, I didn't discriminate against you. It's not bad, the family should be quite rich with a famous brand, didn't you spend a lot of money to transfer you here? Did you come from your own country again? Thompson asked, looking at it. You shouldn't be short of money, don't cause trouble. A.I. Lee looked at the other person's clothes, and it was obvious that he was not short of money. I'm not short of money, but I like to ask you people for money. It's better to earn money than to ask my family. Thompson laughed. It makes sense, and he is still a self-reliant master. A.I. Lee said something appreciative, and then continued. I'm proud of your parents, study hard and make progress every day. After finishing speaking, A.I. Lee turned around and was about to leave. Hey! Do you really not understand? yellow-skinned monkey. Thompson was very upset when he heard A.I. Lee say such a thing. This is to raise one's seniority, to be one's uncle? He yelled at A.I. Lee with anger. As soon as A.I. Lee stopped, he gave the opponent a chance. Don't. Peter Parker was a little anxious when he saw A.I. Lee's actions. He knew that A.I. Lee was a transfer student, and he was also of Chinese descent. Thompson's family is not simple, can't afford to mess with it. Could you lend me a moment? A.I. Lee didn't intend to kill anyone, and asked a passing classmate. Without waiting for the other party to answer, he took the keyboard in the other party's hand, then turned around and walked directly towards Thompson. Hey, look, what is he going to do? Thompson was a little surprised to see his actions. Is this going to fight? He's on the football team, fighting? He is not afraid. Boom. A.I. Lee walked up to the opponent in three or two steps. His pace was normal in front, but he suddenly accelerated in the last two steps. Almost in the blink of an eye, he stood in front of Thompson, before the other party finished speaking, A.I. Lee hit the other party's face with a one-click disc. Boom. There was another sound, this time it was the sound of the opponent hitting the cabinet door after being hit in the face. Thompson. The other party's companion shouted in shock when they saw this scene, and then they also wanted to do it. Can. They are not in the same dimension at all, A.I. Lee sees their movements as slow motion. Then he punched the man directly to the ground. The black guy didn't know where to pull out a baseball bat, just as he was about to make a move, A.I. Lee snatched it and knocked him unconscious with a casual slap. Thank you.
After taking the baseball bat, he didn't forget to say something to the other party, then turned his head and picked up the metal baseball bat and looked at his front teeth, which were still covering his mouth and picking up the ground. No. Peter was taken aback by this. What are you doing? A teacher noticed something was wrong and ran over. Seeing the school manager's son Thompson being beaten like this, his face turned black. Seeing A.I. Lee holding a baseball bat again, he hurriedly shouted, Stop it now, or I'll fire you. He's the son of the school manager. A.I. Lee looked at the teacher and smiled. Yes, stop, we still have to talk like this. The teacher heaved a sigh of relief when he saw him stop. Then. Boom. 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 At this moment, everyone around looked at this scene in astonishment. A.I. Lee seemed to be a butcher, slaughtering Thompson, a pig lying on the ground. One stick fell on the opponent's head, and each remaining stick hit the opponent's body and limbs. When a stick falls, it doesn't stop. Blood is running, A.I. Lee doesn't know why, looking at the blood, he is a little happy. The factors in the body seem to be jumping, and the S cells seem to be cheering. There is a blood red light shining in the eyes, this feeling is great. Chapter 12 My son is fighting at school, very good. Two tenths. Everyone was stunned, they had seen school violence before. Most of the people who did it were Thompson who was being beaten, and no one dared to say anything because of the identity of the other party's school director's father. In this regard, Peter Parker has the most experience, because he is the one who is bullied the most. But this time it was Thompson who was beaten, and this one was beaten with incredible strength. How should I put it, Thompson didn't dare to learn to play like this with a baseball bat. He usually uses his fists, and the role of the baseball bat is to scare him. Moreover, seeing the blood continued, Thompson's howling became smaller and smaller, as if there was no movement. A. I. Lee. Peter Parker was too frightened to move, but for some reason he was a little excited inside. Especially the way Thompson was beaten, it was exactly the same as his fantasy scene. But he couldn't beat himself, and he didn't dare to fight back, so A. I. Lee actually did this. How handsome. Enough. The incident has escalated to another stage, and the director also arrived at the scene, shouting and stopping A. I. Lee's actions. In fact, it was about to stop, and A. I. Lee didn't intend to kill anyone. Seeing that Thompson's anger was getting weaker and weaker, fearing that he might die, A. I. Lee also stopped. It's all gone. A. I. Lee, come to the office with me. Throwing away the baseball bat casually, A. I. Lee glanced at Peter Parker, gave him a helpless look, and followed the director's footsteps. What should I do? You won't be expelled. Peter was a little at a loss, and then remembered his classmate Gwen. The other party's father is the director at New York, and we are all classmates, so we should be able to help. Yeah, racism, Thompson called A.I. Lee a yellow skin, as long as it can be proved. Peter Parker is very smart. I thought of this on the way to find Gwen, and planned to ask Gwen to help contact her father, and then finding a good lawyer should be able to solve it. But I don't know, A.I. Lee doesn't worry about these at all. Following him into the office, he casually sat on the sofa and leaned back. Seeing this action, the director was furious. Call your parents here. In a word, he planned to ask the parents to come forward. I think it's better to forget it, A.I. Lee replied. Looking at A.I. Lee with strange eyes, this is the first time a student dared to talk to his director like this. The incident developed very quickly, the principal appeared, the school manager appeared, and then the school manager claimed to be Thompson's father. It's boring. To be honest, this kind of pretense and slap in the face A. I. Lee really didn't expect it to come so suddenly. But he really didn't intend to do this, he's already kept a low profile, okay? Thompson had provoked himself, so he turned around and left, ignoring it, after all, he was not at the same level. But the other party insisted on looking uncomfortable and called himself a yellow monkey. You must know that in the flower growers, no one dares to call them this, which is an unacceptable name. A. I. Lee will take action to teach the opponent a lesson. The situation is really meaningless now, A. I. Lee stood up directly. If you want to find your parents, think about it clearly. If you don't, you can fire me or punish me. Anyway, I did beat someone, I'll leave first. By the way, if you want to lose money, tell me the amount. A. I. Lee walked directly towards the door, as for what they did, I had no interest in it. My mother asked me to come to school, and I have been here for two days. I was expelled because of this kind of thing, so I don't blame myself, right? Yes, my mother will forgive myself. And if he is really fired, A.I. Lee smiles at the corner of his mouth, it seems that it is not bad. 
Watching A.I. Lee leave blankly, the group of them were at a loss, because they couldn't step forward to stop each other. The action of beating someone before rushing towards A.I. Lee is obviously a ruthless person. They are worried that they will offend the other party, so what if they also attack them? Look for his parents. We must. I want them to apologize. Thompson blushed and shouted. The director hurriedly found the number in the file and dialed it, then talked for a long time before hanging up. The other party seems to be a housekeeper, but I want to call A.I. Lee's father. I'll call again. The director finished talking to several people and called again. Is it A.I. Lee's father? I'm the director of Midtown High. I'm coming. Thompson's father took the phone directly and said, I'm the school manager, your son fought with my son, and now I hurt my son, you come to the school to apologize. I can spare your son once, otherwise you got it. Snapped. Beep beep beep. Jin Bing listened to the blind voice on the phone with a confused look on his face. Has he, the underground emperor, been threatened? PFFT. Then he couldn't help laughing again. This kid is fighting with someone at school? Jin Bing couldn't imagine what that scene was like. The more I think about Jin Bing, the happier I laugh, and finally I just burst out laughing. That's what's interesting, like a child. Then his face darkened again. My Jin Bing's child, you can't lose your momentum even in a fight. Threatening me? Standing up, Jin Bing leaned on his own weapon and walking stick, and walked towards the outside of the villa step by step. Are you okay? Peter Parker asked hurriedly when he saw A.I. Lee return to the classroom. You don't have to worry, I've already asked my dad. Although you've been serious this time, he doesn't dare to make trouble when it comes to racial issues. Gwen also came up to help and said a few words. Besides, I also asked my dad to come over and let him watch you solve the problem. He is the son of the school director and dare not mess around. Regarding what Thompson did, there are still many people in the school who are clear about it. There must be someone who is willing to testify, even if there is no. Next to Peter Parker is one. It's nothing. Don't worry, the most you can do is lose some money, or drop out of school. What else can you do? A.I. Lee had nothing to worry about. The concern of the two made A.I. Lee a little surprised, but they were classmates in the same class, and they only worked so hard for one day. Pretty good. What he didn't know was that Peter was also bullied by Thompson, and seeing A.I. Lee being treated like this was unbearable and he was wise enough to know what Thompson's talkativeness would cause this time. It was a rare opportunity to punish Thompson, and he didn't want to miss it. In the United States, racial discrimination is a matter of great importance. The most important thing is that he can see that A.I. Lee is not like those ordinary foreign students. Because he is not from here, he dare not provoke him. There are many Asians who are bullied here, and most of them dare not speak out because of this. Even many Asian girls are also because of this. Not only do they not resist after being bullied, but they can only fall in love with them obediently. It is not surprising that a female student has several boyfriends, because the first boyfriend will party, bring others to play. Gwen helped him because Papa Gwen was the director of New York, and a sense of justice was burning in her heart, and she wanted to take action. I'll go, what's the situation? Come and see, there are many people at the school gate. At the moment, suddenly a classmate stood by the window dumbfounded, and then shouted at the people in the classroom. A.I. Lee has a bad feeling. Today, the second day after publishing the book, we will start at the tenth shift as usual, and ask for flowers and monthly tickets for rewards. Please support me. Chapter 13, Dad goes out, one fights two, three tenths asking for flowers. A.I. Lee didn't move, because his anger was instantly perceived by the situation outside especially the dazzling aura in the crowd, which is different. Gwen and Peter Parker ran over. Then they saw an unexpected scene, making them stand on the spot. Countless cars appeared at the school gate, the leader was a stretched Cadillac, the whole car was bulletproof, and even the tires were specially made. The rest were all large Chevrolet SUVs. After one car stopped, a few men in black got out of each car. As for the extended Cadillac, a walking stick was stuck on the ground, and Jinbin, who was wearing a white suit, just got out of the car. One person walked towards the school gate, followed by hundreds of subordinates, all of them imposing. In this scene, the security guards at the gate didn't dare to move, let alone stop them, and watch them come in helplessly. Gudong. The security guard at the school gate took a few more glances and saw that there was a bulge under the black suit of every person in black. In this city where you can carry a gun with a gun license, everyone knows what the bulge is. Etc. A.I. Lee suddenly remembered something, and then looked at Gwen by the window. 
You just said that your further is coming? Yeah, Gwen nodded, and then looked at the large group of people who walked in, with an incredulous expression on her face. Don't tell me, those people are your father. My dad took the lead, A.I. Lee replied with a dark face. What do you mean that group of people are dads? Your little mouth is really smeared with honey. Hey, A.I. Lee has a bit of a headache, the principal of this school still contacted his parents. Does Karen make a living? The contact information I left belongs to him. I can't handle this well? The most troublesome thing is that Gwen's father is the chief of a New York City police department, and his father is the underground emperor of New York. Good guy, king to king. This is the meeting of the two bosses of black and white. Clutching his head, A.I. Lee suddenly felt that there was a good show to watch this time. Sure enough, not long after, another police car drove into the campus. This scene made countless students look surprised, why is there still a police car coming? The security guards at the gate were at a loss. When hundreds of people with guns in their pockets entered the campus, you arranged for a police car. Could it be that Captain America is sitting in this police car? Should we call the police? The security guard thought a little embarrassedly. Report it, the police cars are here. Don't report it, he thinks the people in this car may not be able to handle it. Forget it, I'd better go there. A.I. Lee felt that this happened because of himself, so he still had to go there. This time Gwen and Peter Parker didn't say a word, because they found out that the Joker was actually me. Worried about A.I. Lee? Hee <laughs> hee. They might as well worry about whether an ambulance will come later, and then drag the school board people away. Ailey actually doesn't really want to act like this, because the result of pretending is trouble. Pretending to win is troublesome, pretending to lose is even more troublesome. No, Thompson was beaten to the ground by him, he pretended to win, and then a bunch of things popped up. If I knew it earlier, I would bear it, and then I would go directly to the other party's house and kill the other party at night. Hello, young master. Master, hello. When A.I. Lee arrived at the principal's office, the subordinates in the two rows at the door instantly stood up straight and shouted. This is a small part, the rest are watching in the aisle. Before anyone enters, the sound arrives first. When he opened the door and walked in, he saw his further sitting on the principal's single sofa chair, smoking a cigar. Sitting opposite was a man in his forties, wearing a police uniform, looking a jinbin with a gloomy expression. The owner of the office, the principal, and several school managers were obediently standing by the window and looking down at the leather shoes, with expressions of nothing to do with them, like obedient babies. I just said don't ask my parents. If you insist, what's the trouble? A.I. Lee said with a sigh. His son scolded you? Jin Bing saw A.I. Lee come in and asked. Well, the scolding is ugly. A.I. Lee replied casually. Oh? He used the most insulting words in the world to describe me. Huh? Jin was a little curious, the most insulting word in the world? What? He said I was a neon man. Jin Bing's face tightened instantly, he was so insulting. Then he spoke with some displeasure. So that's what you did? As soon as these words came out, the principal and the school directors were taken aback, and then they wanted to raise their heads in surprise, seeing that this posture, Jin Bing didn't seem to be unreasonable to protect the cubs. There is still room for turning things around. Didn't I think the school would solve the school's affairs, so I just beat him up casually. If I had known it would be such a trouble, I would have asked Karen to bring someone over to blow up his house in the evening, turning it into a gang fight. As soon as A.I. Lee opened his mouth, the school manager's body trembled, good guy, this kid is a bit crazy. Then he looked at the man in the police uniform sitting at the desk with a distressed look. It's quite smart. Jin Bin just laughed, and then looked provocatively at George Stacy across the way. Jin Bin, don't go too far. George Stacy said angrily, in front of himself, the New York police chief, he dared to say that. And this child is so presumptuous, this family is indeed a gangster. Then catch me, I'm right here, don't you always say you can't catch me? Jin Bin smoked the cigar in one gulp, took out another one, and played with the cigar tongs in his left hand. The cigar tongs clicked, and the sound of clicking clicked, and Jin didn't care about the embarrassingly dark-faced George. Jin was very happy to turn a white director into a black man. Do you think I dare not arrest you? George couldn't bear it any longer. He slapped the table with one hand, stood up, stared at Jin and roared angrily. A.I. Lee, what if I get caught? Daddy, will I be sentenced to death? Jin turned his head and looked at A.I. Lee and asked. If there are no accidents, you will be released on the third day. After all, 
New York needs you. A. I. Lee knew what he meant. He wanted to make trouble in front of the director, deliberately looking for a place. A. I. Lee was also happy to cooperate, saying this on purpose. What if you don't let go? George knew what the other party meant. Jane can't be caught. He can be captured by gangsters, he can die at the hands of mercenaries and killers, but he can't be captured by the police. Then New York is chaotic. There may be gun battles everywhere at night, and the flower trading is blatant in the daytime. A. I. Lee Shampo replied. George just felt a toothache, which is why the New York government won't catch King. New York can have gangsters and needs an underground emperor. This is political correctness. Chief police officer? Jane stood up, smiled disdainfully at director George, and then walked towards the school manager. Looking at the school manager whose legs began to tremble after approaching, Jin Bin's eyes were fixed, and a pressure fell from him to the school manager's body in an instant. You threatened me on the phone? No, it's not, I didn't know it was you. The school manager knelt on the ground with trembling legs. Jingle, Jin threw the cigar tongs on the ground, walked out without picking them up. School manager? Cut. Jin, who shook his head he he, left with a large group of people, and A. I. Lee also felt that it was meaningless to leave. In a few seconds, a painful howl sounded. Just now the school manager ran up to Jin Bing with something bloody in his hands, and spread his hands. What was inside was a finger, and one finger was missing from his hand. Chapter 14 Impress You, Young Master. So that's the reason for you father and son to appear before the public. An old man ran to the school and confronted the police chief, and still cut it? A person who is not very old, but whose strength is similar to that of Superman, pretending to be aggressive. Still cooperating with your father? I'm really convinced. You do this, A.I. Lee, how do you make friends at school? Mr. Jinbin. Are you going to be watched by the police every day from today? In the largest building in the 35th Street Villa area of Hell's Kitchen in New York, a woman was sitting on the sofa and was angry, panting heavily from her mouth. On the other side, a bloated man over two meters tall held a teacup and handed it to the woman. Behind her was a 14-year-old boy who was 1.8 meters tall and pinched her shoulders with a smile. It's all A. I. Lee's fault. He wants to pretend to be aggressive. My father must cooperate. You ask me to give him more fatherly love. Jin Bing said with a smile. Yes, yes, yes. Ali rolled his eyes at Jin. Did he sell me? Really? Vanessa looked at her husband suspiciously. Definitely. I'm not a man. The underground emperor of New York. Jin Bing puffed out his chest and patted his chest and replied. What kind of person do I need to appear in front of me? I need those false names? I get tens of millions every minute. Then why did I hear that you left phone calls for several schoolgirls when you left, and said that the girls' school uniforms at Midtown High School are pretty good, all of which are miniskirts and white socks? Vanessa asked with her eyes narrowed. Jin Bing was stunned, and countless appearances of female students flashed through his mind, and then he flung aside and shouted with a flushed face. Who, who slandered me, Jin Bing? Who in Manhattan doesn't know that I, Jin Bing, loves my wife the most? who doesn't know that I love my family the most. Puff, it's okay, it's just pretending. Vanessa couldn't help smiling when she saw Jin Bing's playful appearance. As soon as this smile came out, Jin Bing knew it was all right. A.I. Lee is so happy in the back. In fact, the current harmony in the family is really because Jin Bing is a person who loves his family and Vanessa. As the boss of a gangster, he really doesn't touch any wildflowers, he only treats Vanessa well. You must know that Vanessa doesn't touch any information about gangsters, and even has her own legitimate career. That is to say, as long as Jin Bing wants to, find a few secretaries by his side, and his mother doesn't know, but Jin Bing still doesn't do that. Perhaps for Jin Bing Lai, Vanessa is his angel. Are you still laughing? How can you still make friends at school after this incident? I let you go to school to study? Is it because you are too precocious, my friend? Seeing that the firepower was transferred to him, Ai Li glanced directly at his father. But he saw Jin Bing was sitting at the side, blowing hot air on the tea he just handed to his mother, with a face that had nothing to do with him. What a fart, you have been serving this tea for more than ten minutes just now, can it be hot? I have a friend, and I handed it in yesterday. Really? Definitely it's true, one is Peter Parker and the other is Gwen. Ai Li replied casually. Gwen? Gwen Stacy? Jin frowned and looked at him. Well, Director George's daughter. A.I. Lee nodded. Interesting, son, 
You don't want to pick her up, do you? Come on, I'm optimistic about you. If you get her, your father will hand over the gang to you. At that time, you will be the emperor of the underground and the son of the police chief. Ha ha ha. Not interested. Early rolled his eyes. Bugwin? Don't be kidding, it's still the same sentence, the other party is an ordinary human being, unable to withstand his own impact. With such a wife, he was afraid of being played to death by himself. What are you not interested in, son, you are not crooked, are you? Let me tell you that it is a good thing to fall in love early. Vanessa immediately became anxious when she heard him say that she was not interested. I'm only fourteen, mum, A.I. Lee said helplessly. I know that the United States is more open, but letting myself fall in love at the age of fourteen is too unrestrained. He can't get used to it. What's the matter at the age of fourteen? There are too many people falling in love in the first year of high school. Vanessa said. Well, it's hard to say that the national conditions are different, and A.I. Lee is willing to bow down. I found a reason to slip away decisively. A.I. Lee is not worried about the family situation. These years, they have been soaking in the foundation building medicine bath just like themselves, and their physical strength is obviously much stronger than before. Especially Jin Bing, whose hidden injuries have long since disappeared, and his physical strength has also improved a lot. After all, he is definitely the most powerful human being on earth except himself. After all, the previous Jinbin was no longer able to exist in a way that ordinary people could understand. The same is true for her mother, Vanessa. She used to be an ordinary person, but now she is definitely more than a thousand catties with one hand. It is also because of this that Vanessa knows how terrifying A.I. Lee's current power is when she doesn't intervene in gang affairs at all. In the past, she only thought that A.I. Lee was a smart and talented boy. Boom. The red eyes were covered by A. I. Lee, and the pace of walking on the street stopped. It's all right, Master. Karen, who was in charge of all his file sizes behind him, noticed something was wrong and hurried up to ask. But as soon as the words fell, the moment Karen met A. I. Lee's eyes, Karen was shocked and subconsciously took two steps behind. He had known for a long time that the young master was too powerful, and besides dealing with life matters, he couldn't intervene in other things like security. But today he realized that the young master surpassed the boss Jinbin not only in strength, but also in aura. A look made him dare not make a sound, as if he was facing a scourge, and he could kill her with a casual wave of his hand. His body was reflected in those red eyes, but it was not the same concern and inquiry as I am now. Instead, he was ups and downs in the Red Sea, shouting and screaming for help. Who, who? A few seconds later, A.I. Lee looked away, and Karen relaxed with relief. She panted continuously, as if sucking all the air into her lungs to make up for the loss just now. I left your number, and that's why you did it? A.I. Lee turned round and suppressed the strangeness in his eyes, and asked casually. Isn't this trying to impress the young master? You are usually too low-key. Karen replied with an embarrassed smile. Chapter 15 Wingman Karen. Five tenths. He slapped Karen on the head angrily, what was this guy thinking in his head? But there's no real punishment. The world in New York is not very peaceful recently. The Stark Group and the Osborne Group are facing each other. In the arms industry, you come and go. Although Stark said that he provided all the weapons to other legitimate national channels, it is unavoidable that there are still many of their weapons on the market. After all, that playboy Tony Stark knows nothing about the sale of the company. He is in charge of picking up girls and research and development, so he doesn't know how to operate it. It seems that it has nothing to do with gold, but the price of weapons on the market has dropped, and too many outflows have also caused many gangsters to update their weapons faster. It is inevitable that some troubles will arise during some help battles. This has also made the situation of the New York City Police Department's jurisdiction over gang severe. The relationship between Jinbin and George Stacy is like fire and water. Karen made some trouble this time, and it was a good intention to do bad things, so that Jinbin made a little bit of money. At their level, attacking a flower group and killing or injuring as many policemen is simply home cooking. For George, the director, or Jin Bin, the boss, there would be no injury at all. On the contrary, face-to-face -face slaps like this are more refreshing. With this in mind, A.I. Lee didn't punish Karen too much, but still gave him an unhappy look, and said. Your salary is gone this month. Yes yes yes, Karen nodded again and again, it was only a month's salary. The bonus is gone. Ah, Karen felt a little heartbroken, this bonus is indeed quite a lot. 
Seeing A. I. Lee walking forward, Karen caught up with him in two or three steps. Master, where are you going? My classmate's band sang, and I went to help her out, A. I. Lee replied. Karen pondered for a while after hearing it, classmate band? Then I took out my little book and started to read, Peter Parker can't sing, Jason Tubman doesn't have a band. Gwen Stacy, daughter of Chief George Stacy, the Mary Jane's band, consisting of Mary Jane Watson, Betty Brandt, and Glory Grant. The young master wants to help Gwen Stacy, and the other party is the director's daughter. He wants to pick up the other party and then give director George a blow, and save face for Jin Bingo. Karen felt that she had seen the truth, she was worthy of being the young master, if she didn't make a move, it would be amazing. No, the young master is working so hard, I can't hold back, I must assist well, Karen felt that this was very important, and there was a stream of wisdom in his serious eyes. Then I called Vanessa and said, Mom, A. I. Lee wants to pursue girls in their class, and I need to approve a fund, A. I. Lee was walking on the road, but her mind was all on what was wrong just now. The sudden irritability was exactly the same as when he beat Thompson yesterday, and it was difficult to control himself, as if the violence made him extremely happy. What's wrong, my body? Is it a cultivation method? A. I. Lee didn't think he was born like this, so the problem appeared in the practice method. Then his first guess was about S cells. S cells are a unique cell type in the Saiyan body, and only Saiyans have them. Transformation into a Super Saiyan is just an opportunity. The most important factor is the S cells in their body. When the S cells in their body accumulate to a certain amount, the anger can be used as an opportunity to make the S cells grow explosively, thus awakens the potential in the body. When this kind of S cells accumulates to a certain amount, it takes anger as an opportunity to make the S cells grow explosively, and the body changes into a super Saiyan. Although almost all Saiyans have S cells, but not many. For Ai Li, the existence of S cells is a result of cultivation, using cultivation methods to upgrade his original cells into S cells, and thus further become a Saiyan. And now the side effects have also appeared, the violent nature of the S cells. Every Saiyan will have a bad temper, and will solve everything with violence. This is because the S cells will make the host subconsciously angry. And if you want to control S cells, you must transform this anger into your own power. Perfect control of S cells, coupled with certain combat power, suitable environment, calm state of mind, coupled with originally emotional anger, can transform into a super Saiyan. You can't have this kind of state. You can't control your temper. What's the difference between that and a demon? No matter how powerful you are, but you can't control yourself, then what you become is not a super saiyan, but a demonized N.I.E. Feng. A.I. Li is very aware of this, and has an existence that defies the sky, so there is no need to fall into the magic way for the sudden burst of power. As long as you give him time, he can become stronger. Suppression of S cells, this must be put on the agenda. Buddhism, Taoism. If the heart is as clear as ice, will the sky collapse? A. I. Lee subconsciously thought of these, then shook his head and continued walking towards the bar. These are things have to go back and read a lot of content, so as to screen and purify, so as to realize new things. Comprehension is based on sufficient knowledge. Not having enough knowledge is bullshit. This is it, right? He looked up at the signboard of the bar, Broken Axe Bar. Master. Just standing still and not going in, the two security guards at the door straightened up and shouted when they saw A. I. Lee. Only then did A. I. Lee know that this bar was also his own business. After all, in Manhattan Island, almost all black industries have their own shares, and even Jin Bing's subordinates opened them. It's just that the other party knew him, which was a little surprising. Stepping into it at will, the melodious singing sound comes from your ears. On the stage, several ladies were singing. A. I. Lee saw Gwen sitting a little to the side at first sight. She was in charge of the drum kit of the band. A. I. Lee has always thought that girls who play drums have a lot of character. The other party obviously also noticed the existence of A. I. Lee, and the two looked at each other and then smiled. Look around, but there is no sign of Peter Parker. It was an appointment, but it seems that Peter failed to escape his aunt's control and was grounded. Attention, now a special guest is coming to the bar. Tonight's consumption will be paid by A. I. Lee Fisk. Cheers. Ailee's hand holding the cocktail froze, and the smile on his mouth stopped in astonishment. When I turned my head, I found that it was Karen who was cheering with a microphone. Cheers from the audience. Oh, ooh, ooh. Originally, some people wondered who was so arrogant. 
There are many rich people here, but when they heard Fisk's surname, they immediately put away their unhappiness and cheered one by one instead. When Gwen Stacy on stage saw A.I. Lee's stiff expression, she immediately understood, and couldn't help but snicker. Chapter 16 Let Me Fly With You, Gwen. Six tenths. So it was all done by your assistant? Gwen asked A.I. Lee curiously. On the side, Gwen's two best friends also looked at A.I. Lee very curiously. Although this man is young, he has a lot of gold. I didn't expect him to be like this, A.I. Lee sighed helplessly. How should I put it? The mind of an adult is clearly possessed of great strength. But he made himself look like an arrogant and domineering rich second generation, pretending to be conspicuous everywhere, which is weird. It's good, at least Gwen seems to be interested in you. Betty Brandt, the little girlfriend on the side, laughed. Betty. Gwen blushed when she heard this. Ellie is actually a handsome guy in their eyes. Everyone is a senior high school student of about the same age, but A.I. Lee is about 1.85 meters tall, and she is not the kind of thin bamboo pole, which is a plus point. Coupled with three-dimensional facial features, handsome appearance, and a head of black hair is still very special here. While most Americans are face-blind to Asians, few here are. Gwen has a good impression of A.I. Lee. But it's just a good impression, not to the level of liking and love. The little girlfriend made such a fuss, which made Gwen feel a little embarrassed. But, sorry, it's just for a moment, because the character of the people here is very unrestrained, and they will show it straightforwardly if they have a good impression. So after being embarrassed, Gwen looked at A.I. Lee again, trying to see from his face whether the other party had the same idea. But A.I. Lee didn't show too much, just smiled. Because what he cares about now is another thing. This Gwen seems to be a little different from what I know. He has a more cheerful personality, is a drummer, and is also a member of the Mary Jane's band, which is different from what he saw in the movie. It turns out that the other Gwen is very similar to her. Spider Woman Gwen. The ghost spider in the black and white pink hooded tights has band experience. Could it be that the Gwen in front of him is actually a ghost spider? If you take a closer look, it is true that the Gwen in front of you is much prettier than those heroine Gwen. The face shape figure and skin are all top choices, as if they came out of the 3D animation area. The spider Gwen in my memory still tends to be a cartoon image, but the one in front of me is a real person. In this comparison, the other party is even more beautiful than what I saw on the E-Station. This time, A.I. Lee became interested in each other. If it is just an ordinary person, A.I. Lee will only become friends with each other, because it is impossible to develop to the follow-up level. I have said it several times. The other party's body is too much for ordinary people. But if Spider Woman Gwen, then. I won't bother you. The little girlfriend saw that the atmosphere between A.I. Lee and Gwen was a bit wrong, so she greeted them tactfully and left. Come on, A.I. Lee, our little lady Gwen is still a chick. Betty. Gwen was not deaf, how could she not hear? Ha ha ha. The three best friends laughed and ran away, leaving Gwen alone. Let's go, I'll take you back. Ellie raised his foot and walked towards the avenue outside, followed by Gwen. The atmosphere between the two of them is indeed a bit weird, like strangers who don't open their mouths, but they seem to be getting closer like familiar friends. The cheerful Gwen was much quieter at this time, and Ailey felt the atmosphere and felt that it was better to open the topic by herself. By the way, after going back yesterday, your father didn't make things difficult for you, did he? You still talk. It's okay not to mention this, but Gwen rolled his eyes when he mentioned this. She never thought that A.I. Lee was Jin Bing's son, and she asked her father to come and protect A.I. Lee. Isn't this cheating on your father? Sure enough, after returning, Dad George's face was darker than the gun on his waist, and he didn't say a word during the meal. Just before going to bed, I said something to keep myself away from the bastard A.I. Lee. Hooligan? A.I. Lee was taken aback, since when did he have this nickname? How do you make it up to me? Gwen asked. Compensation? This. A. I. Lee was a little confused. What compensation is there for this? Compensation for what? Oh. In a car in the distance, several men in black heard A. I. Lee's words in the earphones and slapped their thighs. The young master is not enlightened. It's time to start tuning the piano, and he still says that. After all, it's the first time, why don't we support it? Karen replied. Back up. You can only use this kind of thing for eavesdropping, you dare to go up? I'm afraid I'll be beaten to death by the young master. Then what to do? Let's do whatever you want, young master, Karen, aren't you ready? 
I don't believe that there are women who don't like this. Another person gritted his teeth and said. Well, I knew that you guys are the most reliable. Karen nodded vigorously after hearing this. These are the only three in their group who have ever been married, and the rest of them are even bachelors. They must be right. Wrong. On A. I. Lee's side, he was thinking about how he should make amends. Would you like to give it to Mercedes-Benz? Or get a Van Cleef and Arpels as a gift? Will it be too low-key? Do a supercar? Will she think that I am too materialistic and want to throw money at her? Forget it anyway. Immediately afterwards, A. I. Lee's eyes lit up, and now Gwen is still an ordinary person, without strong energy in her body, so she was not bitten by a spider. That being the case, he must have no idea about supernatural power. Shall I send you to heaven? A. I. Lee said. Gwen's face froze, God, God. Followed by a ruddy face, what can this guy say about tigers and wolves? Young master is awesome. As expected of the young master, you will go to heaven, as soon as you open your mouth. It's too straightforward. Girls probably can't accept it, so be cool. Fart. Young master, this is called driving straight in. Karen looked at a few people with disdain, and they were married, that's all. I mean, take you to the sky. Seeing her appearance, A.I. Lee thought she didn't understand, so she spoke again. What do you mean? Gwen felt that no matter how stupid A.I. Lee was, he wouldn't say such a thing, and it was better to ask clearly. Are you afraid of heights? That's not true. Then don't worry about it, I'll show you to experience it for yourself. A. I. Lee approached, and then directly supported Gwen with her hands, hugging Princess Gwen just like that. Subconsciously, Gwen put her arms around A. I. Lee's neck, a little at a loss, why she hugged herself suddenly. Are you ready? What? Gwen was taken aback. Then, she saw a scene that subverted the world view, and she actually flew up. In A. I. Lee's arms, the two rose directly from the spot. There is no flight device, no wire sling, just leap out of thin air, then hover in the air, and move forward at high speed in one direction. I beg for flowers, beg for evaluation tickets, monthly tickets, please everyone. Chapter 17, Ancient One Married, All Get Away, Seven Tenths. Fly, fly, fly. Flying fart. What are you talking about? Karen was listening carefully to the voice in the earphones, and the only thing left was whirring. I wonder if the young master and this Gwen have developed to the next step. Hearing the disturbance from his companions around him, he couldn't help but get angry. No, the young master has flown, said the companion. At this moment, Karen looked up, and then saw A. I. Lee holding Gwen in the air, and then flew into the sky. Everyone was stunned. My young master can fly? Can you fly? Gwen asked, staring at A. I. Lee's chin in front of her, which is too exaggerated. How come there are still people who can fly? This is completely beyond the boundaries of ordinary people. Well, how about this compensation? A. I. Lee smiled at her. Can you go faster? Gwen enjoyed the feeling of the wind blowing across her face, very happy. Flying is also suspended in the air in a sealed space, but now it is a complete experience. Then hurry up. After A. I. Lee agreed, he accelerated again. Hurry up. Faster. Ha 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 ha. It can't go any faster. A. I. Lee didn't continue to accelerate as Gwen said, not because he couldn't do it, but because he couldn't. The current speed is close to super high speed, and if it accelerates upwards, it will reach the speed of sound. A. I. Lee's physical body is definitely fine, but Gwen is human, and her body is an ordinary person. If she accelerates any further, she is afraid that she will be directly torn into pieces by the centrifugal tearing force. I haven't mastered the power of the biological position yet, so I can't take you beyond this limit. A. I. Lee is also studying this point, and his comprehension in this area has never stopped. Biological standpoint is a particularly powerful thing, not only to protect other people, but also to cover one's own power to other levels. If he can control the biological position, A. I. Lee's strength may be able to climb up a level. Now, he can only use chi to cover his surroundings and block the passing hurricanes. But if it exceeds the speed of sound, the gas will not be able to stop Gwen. Okay then. Gwen didn't force it, it was very refreshing now. She wants to speed up just subconsciously wanting to challenge the stimulation. After some leaps, A. I. Lee brought Gwen back to the ground. After going through this time, Gwen couldn't help holding A. I. Lee's hand after landing, always thinking that only in this way can she feel that all this is not a dream. A. I. Lee didn't refuse either, just casually walking along the street, chatting about many things that had nothing to do with him. Crack, clap, clap. 
when the two walked to the edge of Manhattan Island, everything on the beach was still a little scary under the cover of night. But suddenly, bursts of explosions sounded, breaking the tranquility. Around the beach, countless fireworks rose into the sky and exploded in the sky. The quality of these firework salutes is very high, and each explosion is extremely gorgeous, attracting the attention of many people who are still resting by the beach at this time. It's so beautiful. Gwen couldn't help staring blankly. A. I. Lee was a little surprised, but he didn't care, and just paid attention to it for a while. It's true that I haven't seen firework for a long time. Foreign countries don't seem to care much about this thing, and I rarely see it released. It is a pity that he saw a lot in his previous life, but he rarely saw it when he grew up in his previous life. After all, the smoking ban made it necessary to go to a designated place to play firework, but he had no chance to go. On this occasion, the two each have their own nostalgia and appreciate this scene. I love a you, Gwen. Suddenly, the exploding firework actually formed a few words, which together are I love you Gwen. At this moment, A. I. Lee was stunned, and Gwen also stiffened in place. Subconsciously, A. I. Lee thought of a possibility in his mind, so his angry perception unfolded instantly. Sure enough, he saw Karen among the crowd who put firework on the beach. The other party, at the moment, was looking at this side with a telescope at the moment. Seeing that the two were very close, he hurriedly waved to his companions, telling them to speed up the ignition speed of firework. Your uncle really knows how to play. A. I. Lee has 10,000 things MMP wants to say. Looking at Gwen whose face is getting closer and closer to him, does talking now affect the atmosphere too much? Those who didn't refuse had to move forward. Soon, a superficial touch occurred between the two of them. Papa Papa. There was applause, A. I. Lee thought it was Karen who came up, and immediately left Gwen's lips and turned around to scold. But seeing the person coming clearly, A. I. Lee's face became more serious. Congratulations. It's a happy marriage. The bald man looked at A.I. Lee and Gwen and smiled. The distance was only more than one meter, which was very close. Gwen blushed in embarrassment when someone who suddenly appeared said so. Seeing that the other party is wearing a light yellow monk's uniform, there are also Buddhist temples abroad. Although he is nothing compared to Christ, he has also heard the saying of ascetic monks. Grand Master. I'm not a master. You can call me Ancient One Magician. The visitor replied with a smile. Ancient One Magician, Gwen nodded, half understanding. Don't worry, I just want to bless you and find A. I. Lee by the way, can I borrow him for a while? Ancient One Magician smiled at Gwen. Ah, okay. Gwen didn't know what it meant, but hearing the other party call A. I. Lee's name, she felt that she should know her. Looking at A. I. Lee strangely, how could A. I. Lee know a female monk? Ancient One Magician, A. I. Lee stared at the Ancient One in front of him, with some consideration. This guy's strength is not simple. Your girlfriend agrees, let's go talk. When Ancient One spoke, he waved his hand, and a golden halo surrounded him, opening a hole like a door. Then deliberately stepped into it first, walked to the other side and looked at A. I. Lee. This is? Gwen felt that she really must have seen a ghost today. What is this? Help me tell my subordinates that I'm fine, just go out for a while and don't worry. After A. I. Lee finished speaking, he followed through the portal. The golden halo disappeared, leaving only Gwen standing there, at a loss. Karen, who was observing all this from a distance, suddenly saw the young master disappear, and ran towards this side in panic. Several people directly took out pistols in their hands, loaded them directly and were ready to fire at any time. Chapter 18 Pua Master Ancient One, There is no A. I. Lee in the future timeline, 8 tenths. In the end, Karen didn't know where A. I. Lee went. Gwen was also unclear, and could only explain that a female magician suddenly ran out and took away A. I. Lee, and also said that the other party opened a space door to leave. Karen was confused and expressed disbelief. But the fact is that, the previous flight of A. I. Lee also made Karen feel that it might be true. This matter was too serious, and he didn't dare to go back and report casually, so he could only pass the phone to Gwen. I see. Jane was silent for a long time, choosing to believe Gwen. I can't help it if I don't believe it, and Jin also remembered that A.I. Lee said something about this world, it seems that magician exists. It's better not to tell Vanessa, if he knows, he might overthrow New York. Jin didn't think it was better not to tell his wife about it. Her character seems very gentle, but when it comes to her family, Vanessa can turn into a tyrant. It is precisely because of this that Jin Bing and her became a family. 
take home as the most important thing. A burst of sparks surrounds the portal, and the portal looks so unstable with this flickering. But the person who opened this portal is the Ancient One, so you can only trust her for its sturdiness. Aili was still a little worried when she shuttled. He was afraid that Ancient One would assassinate him, so he closed the portal the moment he stepped over, and he became two halves. No kidding, the big magician has done this before, and Bifrost can do the same. The cutting of space is too sharp to stop. In the antique bedroom, A.I. Lee stepped in, and saw a bald man in a bay robe standing there waiting for him. A gentle smile on her face seems harmless to humans and animals, but whoever says she is a good person, A.I. Lee and who are in a hurry. At this level of strength, good guys and bad guys can't be used to describe their personalities. Whether it is worth it or not is the keynote of survival. Hi A.I. Lee, it's a pleasure to meet guests from another space here. Ancient One said it was a bomb, and A.I. Lee was a little surprised by this sentence. But, again as expected. How could Ancient One, who has been observing the future, fail to discover that there is one more variable in this world? If there was an extraordinary person, she would naturally not pay attention. But there is one more person who is capable and may cause trouble in the future, she doesn't know that there is a problem. It's already very face-saving to say something other than I am the maintainer of the Earth, outsiders, your journey ends here. Hello Sorcerer Supreme. A.I. Lee was quite casual, and began to observe everything around him. The Ancient One Magician, now the Sorcerer Supreme on the Earth, has lived for countless years, about 500 years old, and is mainly responsible for the Earth not being invaded by Mephisto from other dimensions. The strength of the opponent is very strong, and it is likely that he has seen one of the four gods of the Marvel Universe forever, and also obtained the Eye of Agamotto from the opponent, and is the owner and user of Time Gem. The other party's information flashed in A.I. Lee's mind. These are all stored in his own memory kingdom, which can be retrieved as long as necessary. I have to say that she is the strongest person I have ever seen in this world so far. Threaten? Have. Big. But it's not that there is no chance of victory, the point is whether it is necessary to become an enemy with her. If I hadn't suddenly discovered that the future was a little bit wrong recently, I really didn't care about a variable that appeared on the earth. It's normal for Ancient One to observe the future as an Asgardian on Earth, but she can't just stare at it all the time, and she will look at it every few years. This time she saw something different, especially an unknown figure appeared in the crowd. She couldn't see the identity of A.I. Lee, but there was an unexpected presence in each picture. It was as if someone knew she was watching the future, so they blocked their observations on the timeline. There is no way, Ancient One can only start to reverse the time for the sake of safety, and it took a long time to find A.I. Lee. So, she brought him here, and she wanted to see what kind of strength A.I. Lee has to do all of this. After contact, Ancient One discovered that A.I. Lee is indeed a different existence, with a strong physical body, strong mental power, broad knowledge, and even recognized himself at first sight. The outsider is her temptation, but A.I. Lee admits it casually. Do you not care about being discovered by yourself and have your own cards? Ancient One didn't want to cause trouble, especially if the other party didn't have any malice towards him, so he took the initiative to add an enemy. The ice and snow outside are still whistling, the opening of the window seems to isolate everything, and the warmth in the house makes people subconsciously relax. Being in the Himalayas, having such a warm house is already a very good thing. The two had already sat down. There were two cups of tea on the small tea table in front of them. The heat was rising. A.I. Lee picked it up and took a casual sip. To be honest, I haven't tasted such a bitter tea for a long time. The tea leaves in Jinban are actually sweeter, and this kind of bitter tea is the one that A.I. Lee drank the most in his previous life. Many people say that life is like tea, which is bitter first and then sweet, what do you think? Ancient One took a sip with a smile and asked, sipping the taste. I don't think so. Life is bitter, even if it is said to be bitter first and then sweet. In fact, the future will still be in bitterness, purely for fun. A.I. Lee doesn't know why she asks that. But chicken soup, who hasn't had it? And A.I. Lee not only drank chicken soup, but also hated it. This kind of topic comes out of nowhere. Sure enough, the corner of the mouth of the Pua Master Ancient One twitched and fell silent. A.I. Lee looked at the tea in his cup and slowly filled it up after he finished drinking it and put it down, showing interest. This thing is a bit interesting, magic is something he planned to learn before, but it is a pity that it takes too long to simply rely on the epiphany of ability. After all, 
He doesn't even have the basic knowledge of magic, so getting started is very troublesome. It's rare not from 100 to 1000, but from 0 to 1. Still can't see. Suddenly, Ancient One opened his eyes and stared at A.I. Lee when he spoke. A.I. Lee looked and found that Ancient One's hands were holding the floating eye of Agamotto, and the time gem was just placed there. Are you observing the past and the future? I still can't see you on the future timeline. Even though you are already standing in front of me, I still can't observe you. So, A.I. Lee looked at her, motioning to speak more clearly. Someone covered up your existence. I was dragged out to a party for dinner, my good guy was late from 5 o'clock to 10 o'clock, and I still have to sing K, I slipped back to code words first. I missed a chance to sing, sad, please support me, send some flower evaluation tickets alright. I will continue to code. Chapter 19 Can this also be called a condition? 9 tenths. Ancient one doesn't understand. The time gem combined with the properties of the Eye of Agamotto is definitely one of the most powerful artifacts. Under such items the future of any existence can be seen. Except for the four gods. But why can't I see A. I. Lee? To put it simply, Ancient One cannot see A. I. Lee in front of him. Now the two of them are sitting here drinking tea and chatting, but if you use Eye of Agamotto to observe the future ten seconds later, you will find that there is only Ancient One here, with a table and two cups, and there is no one on the opposite side. Is the existence of A. I. Lee higher than the four gods? Impossible, absolutely impossible. One can imagine how difficult it is for a human being to evolve to the point of surpassing the gods, and this cannot be achieved with the accumulation of time. Even ago, a former member of the Elders of the Universe has gone through thousands of years and is still working hard to evolve his life planet. He has been slack every day for so long, but he still hasn't been able to enter the multi universe level. This is the embodiment of difficulty. Can't you see me in the future? A.I. Lee looked at Ancient One in surprise, which was unexpected information. A.I. Lee himself doesn't know why, but it's undoubtedly good news. So, can the Time Administration see me? A.I. Lee asked. Ancient One raised his head and looked at him curiously. Time Administration? He actually knows this existence? It should not be seen, because the particularity of Time Gem is absolutely top in this universe, and the observation of the Time Management Bureau is indeed powerful. But this is a rule-like situation, unless that person observes it himself. If you leave this timeline, definitely, if you leave this timeline, and your hidden existence does not take care of you again and cover up your traces, then everyone will know. Understood. A.I. Lee nodded. Universally speaking, objects have a future because they cannot get rid of light tracing. If they can get rid of light tracing, they can get rid of the established future. At present, the only thing that can distort light tracing is a black hole with a huge mass. A.I. Lee stroked his chin and followed the train of thought of Ancient One, and began to think about his current situation. He doesn't know how to do it, but this kind of thing can be deduced in the future. Because science can accept everything, if it cannot be explained, it means that the current science has not yet reached this threshold. A.I. Lee's understanding can be deduced, which means that his scientific explanation is on the rise. So, as long as there is enough mass or energy, light tracing can be distorted, and the future can be changed. Even the future can be covered up. Has my energy reached this level? If it can, it is myself who covers me, if not. Ali raised his head to look at the other party, his eyes met, and the corner of Ancient One's mouth twitched. If you can't, it may be that you in the future cover up the you in the present. Rubbing his temples, Ancient One was still thinking about Ali's words. The other party asked her to say this answer and she blurted out naturally following his words, but she didn't understand the actual scientific cognition at all. You play science, it really makes people feel headache. Aren't your magic tricks incomprehensible to current science? A.I. Lee laughed. So what did you bring me here for? I don't think it's necessary for a busy Sorcerer Supreme to call me in for a chat. Sorcerer Supreme will not call him here casually, even if his strength may break through the current limit, or his existence threatens the earth. If necessary, Ancient One will choose to kill him, or cultivate him. But he will never be called here to make daily routines. This is the most meaningless approach. I want to ask you for a favor. Ancient One smiled. Obviously, she had been waiting for this sentence for a long time. The corner of A.I. Lee's mouth twitched, feeling that he really couldn't bear it anymore. How could it compare to arguing with a hundred-year-old magician? The ensuing tug of war is the price Ancient One has to pay for his so-called help. You come and go, 
At this moment, the other party seems to be no longer the humble magician, but an aunt selling vegetables on the street corner. Spit out lotus flowers at the mouth, the tongue skill is amazing. That's it, A.I. Lee, you help me with this, all my information here is open to you. If you need to ask anything you don't understand, everyone here can be the object of your consultation. Your name will be recorded in the holy place, and you will become a member of the Cosmic Magician Federation. Telling the conditions that he needs to pay one by one, Ancient One's face is full of melancholy, as if he has suffered a great loss. A.I. Lee did not refuse this, and at this time he won the benefits. Ancient One left, quietly. The magician who appeared in the next second was named Modu, and he was the big magician who assisted Ancient One here. Are you A.I. Lee? Sorcerer Supreme has told us about you, please follow me. Modu stretched out his hand as a guide, leading the way towards the room. Sorcerer Supreme seems to value you very much, your ability is very strong? Modu asked curiously. It is said that he introduced A.I. Lee, but in fact, he asked them to help him a lot, and showed that A.I. Lee had any questions, and they had to answer them. This kind of treatment is not like an intern magician joining here, but a guest here. Mordo thinks so. I don't know, maybe maybe maybe, just average. A.I. Lee has never tried to learn magic, so she is not sure. By the way, are all the magic books in the library? Passing by the library, A.I. Lee asked, pointing to it. Yes. You can go in if you want, it's open to the public. Open to the outside world? A.I. Lee showed surprise, this. Don't get me wrong, I mean it is open to every magician. Kamartage will not hide knowledge, anyone who needs it can go in and read it. Modu thought that A.I. Lee had misunderstood that anyone could enter, so he hurriedly explained that he needed to be able to find this place in order to enter. Ordinary people shout twice outside the door that I want to read your magician books, so it is definitely impossible to bring them in. Only when you enter the holy place can you see it. You mean, as long as I'm here, I can watch it? A.I. Lee asked a little annoyed, so why is the condition I just negotiated with Ancient One necessary? This is also a condition? That guy from Ancient One still looks like he's lost a lot. Ancient One, A.I. Lee looked directly at the tea room just now and shouted. I see, talkative module. Ancient One's voice sounded, and then a green light flew out from the door and landed in A.I. Lee's hand. Looking down, Ilvagamotto, Time Gem is also inside. That's about the same. A.I. Lee nodded in satisfaction, this is called a reward. Although it must have been lent to myself, it would be nice to have a look. On one side, Modu Magician's eyes widened, so, give it? Chapter the tenth of maybe too late today, so I'll make it up tomorrow morning. In addition, tomorrow is a minimum of ten chapters. Then ask for flowers, ask for monthly tickets, and ask for rewards. Thank you Lanyami for sending me monthly tickets, thank you. Chapter 20 The King's Confusion, 10 tenths. This is your room. The holy place does not restrict personal freedom, but the premise is that you can leave by yourself. For clothes, you can use your own, or you can wear the clothes here. They are all standard monk clothes. When you go out from the laundry room, turn right at the end and wash it yourself. And this. Modu is still in a daze until now, the Eye of Agamotto thrown to A.I. Lee by Ancient One Magician is in the opponent's hand. This is something that represents the status of Sorcerer Supreme, and it was just handed over to a newcomer. Unbelievable. Modu even suspected that Ancient One wanted to train A.I. Lee as an heir. How strong is the opponent's ability, and why? After explaining, he handed a note to A.I. Lee, then turned and left. His back was full of vicissitudes when he left. Thinking about the position of Sorcerer Supreme for countless years, it seems to be gone? Open the note, there is a series of numbers and letters on it. Not surprisingly, this is the wireless network password, and the sound of the phone ding 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 after connecting it can be heard endlessly. Gwen, A.I. Lee, are you okay? I don't know if you can receive the information where you go. Gwen, your father came to me just now, and I told him everything that happened. He doesn't seem to be that worried. Gwen. It seems that you have a lot of secrets, waiting for your reply. Number one underground thug in New York, Gwen said that you were taken away by a female magician. Was it the ancient one magician you mentioned? Number one underground thug in New York, if there is any danger, contact me in time. If I don't receive the message, I will also find the magician's message. Number one underground thug in New York, don't worry, if something happens to you, I'll take the whole gang to find a place for you. A.I. Lee looked at Dad's message and nodded. Sure enough, the note of the number one underground thug in New York was not fake, it was very appropriate. 
AI Lee, I'm safe, don't worry. A message was copied and passed on to the two. AI Lee casually put the phone aside. These two are the ones who don't have to worry. It's still surprising that dad actually remembered the name Ancient One. Naturally, he would not take the initiative to tell Jinping the true face of the world. The more he knew, the more dangerous he would be. Especially if Kim doesn't know some supernatural being that close, he's bound to have some small idea to try, and the cost could be huge. As for Ancient One, it was the name Ai Li accidentally mentioned once, just saying that the other party is not a simple female magician and cannot be provoked. But did not expect. Even now that it is remembered, my father still cares about what he said. Ai Li also left the room after getting rid of her worries. The focus of learning magic is the mastery of energy and the understanding of magic. To put it bluntly, it is still learning. Just like your own comprehension, you have enough theoretical knowledge to base yourself on, and then try to decompose the knowledge you have obtained. Repurify, try to use, analyze your behavior, purify again, and comprehend a better method. This is true understanding. So learning is the most important foundation, and the goal of AI Li is the library. He didn't go directly to Modu and other magicians to learn, because their teachings are their own understanding. The importance of the teacher is inevitable, but the other party will also have their own weaknesses that are uniquely understood. It is more appropriate to understand it yourself first, and then ask them where they don't understand. Hey Ali, welcome to the ocean of knowledge. As soon as he entered the library, the bald man sitting in the center greeted him. In the dark library, there is only the light of a candle in his place, combined with the reflection of the bald head, it really feels a bit eerie. Ai Li twitched the corner of his mouth with difficulty, then walked over. The first ones are basic magic books. You can read them, or you can ask me directly. Sorcerer Supreme has already told everyone here. My name is Wang, and I'm the administrator here. Hello, Wang, your name is really domineering. Ai Li nodded to express his understanding, but he didn't pay attention to him, but looked at the collection of books. The front end is also the one closest to the door. There are some stacked books, which are neatly arranged and look nothing special. They are displayed in the same way as a normal library. The middle layer is special, each book is separated, and there is an introduction to the book below the book. The ones in the middle are written by the great magicians in the past. They contain their insights and insights, as well as their own original ways of using magic. Wang's voice sounded. Ai Li expressed his understanding and continued to look towards the last row. This row is even more special. Every book is suspended in the air and locked by chains, but it can be taken out as long as you go forward and disassemble it. It is not very difficult, and the form is greater than the practice. Those are some advanced magic books, which Sorcerer Supreme bought from great magicians or some strange existences in the universe. Each book has its own danger. The perfect NPC explanation is speaking beside you, just like a tour guide giving you instructions. The last book, A.I. Lee saw the book alone on a table, but just glanced at it and didn't read any more. Turn around and go back to the first row, and then take a book. Summary of Magic Theory He looked aside again, nodded, and took it down again. The Origin and Use of Magic, History of Magic for Millions of Years Holding the three books in his hand, A.I. Lee walked over to Wang and sat down directly, and opened the first book. Wang didn't bother him, but was a little surprised to see that A.I. Li ignored the last book and picked up the most basic book. When he came here for the first time, he couldn't resist reading that book, even none of the magicians in the entire holy place could resist. Because that book has an attractive magic power, but A.I. Li didn't respond at all. Two possibilities, one is that A.I. Li doesn't have any magic ability at all, which is obviously unlikely, it is impossible for Sorcerer Supreme to find such a person here. The second is that the other party's perseverance and tenacity are beyond ordinary people, and his spirit will not be easily polluted. Read your book, don't stare at me like that. A.I. Li didn't raise his head, but there were only him and Wang here, obviously speaking to Wang. Yes. Wang subconsciously replied, and then showed a strange face. Why do I feel that I am the new apprentice, and the other party is the teacher who is supervising me? I have finally finished writing the tenth chapter of today. Go to bed, and get up tomorrow morning to continue the tenth change. Please ask for flowers and monthly tickets. I should be the hardest working author. Please support me. The monthly tickets and flower evaluation tickets are all given I will, thank you. Chapter 21 Comprehend Magic, New Cognition The ocean of books is vast, and every drop of water in it is useful knowledge. 
as a qualified flower grower, nine years of compulsory education, three years of college entrance examination and five years of university. After graduation, you have to overturn all the things you have learned and relearn skills in the internship. It can be said that books are familiar to every member of the florists. A.I. Lee is now like a sponge, constantly absorbing every bit of useful resources, and then reviewing it when it is full, then going to his own memory kingdom, finding a suitable place to lock it inside. Pick up the next one, A.I. Lee continues to absorb. Wang was still reading his own book at first, but he was a little confused when he heard A.I. Lee's voice flipping the pages. Is this reading a book or flipping through it? Ten lines at a glance, I really scanned the past, and then the next page, do you understand? After such a short period of time, the magic book with a thickness of more than 10 centimeters has been read to the next one? At this moment, Wang felt that the other party was either teasing him, or he was just a scumbag. Can't understand. The essence of magic. After finishing the three books, A.I. Lee closed his eyes and recalled what he saw. The basic things are what he cares most about. Only by understanding the nature of the foundations can you understand the existence of magic. Why can't the power of magic be based on current science? A.I. Lee spoke suddenly, breaking the silent library, and the sound surrounded her. Hearing the question, Wang thought for a while, and was about to answer, but did not expect that A.I. Lee had already continued to speak. Because current science cannot explain idealism. The power of the heart comes from originally, from its own energy, cells, DNA, blood, and skin. The soul is the manifestation of spiritual power, and the essence of spiritual power is the heart, so idealism is more suitable for learning magic. Current science cannot explain it, and people who believe in science cannot understand it, so scientism cannot replace idealism. A.I. Lee is talking to himself, he is asking himself, and he is answering. Wang looked at the other side blankly, A.I. Lee's answer was somewhat similar to his thoughts, but he couldn't explain it so comprehensively. What Wang wanted to say was because magic does not belong to science. Obviously, his answer seemed a bit one-sided. Where does the power of magic come from? A.I. Lee's next question came up again. Wang thought for a while, with the help of other Mephister. Just as he was about to speak, he heard A.I. Lee speak by himself again. This time, Wang's expression was even more dull. Personal energy. The mind and spiritual power developed by the magician himself, such as manipulation, thought casting, spiritual energy and even astral projection written in the source and use of magic, all use personal energy, that is your own spiritual power. The magical energy of the cosmic environment. With the power of the universe, this power cannot appear out of thin air, so its source is sourced. The word eternity was mentioned in history of magic for millions of years. One of the four gods, his power is the magical ability of the universe. But this power is limited by the latitude, and can only be in the dimension where eternity is located, used in applications such as teleportation and energy waves. Magical power in outer latitudes, use this ability to summon the existence and objects of the magical dimension to gain power, they are different from the physical and magical rules of our world, users need to plead with these people, through sacrifice or promise as a price, to use these Mephistos strength. The three have their own advantages and disadvantages. The first one is too difficult, and few people can do it. The second one has great terror. It makes deals with the four gods. He doesn't look down on what mortals have, so you may be the one who has to pay. Something incomprehensible. The third one gets the power the fastest, but it is also very dangerous, because the price you pay may be your own life or become the other party's slave. What else? A.I. Lee's voice slowly dimmed, and he also stood up, walked to the bookshelf and continued to search for the books he needed. Wang watched the other party leave his seat with his mouth wide open, then swallowed. This guy, is it really his first contact with magic? Wang felt that this was a fantasy. After reading a few books, the understanding of magic has advanced to such a level, this is a monster. Or is the other party the reincarnation of a legendary magician or Mephisto? Suddenly Wang was taken aback. At his current stage, he is stuck in the use of advanced magic among which he has not yet mastered astral projection. Just now A.I. Lee said that the power of astral projection needs your own spiritual power, not the power of the latitude Mephista. Instead of Waishandi's power, use your own. After Wang was silent for a while, he began to dry. What do you think I should read next? A.I. Lee's voice sounded. Wang Gang was startled when he was about to continue studying. He could tell that A.I. Lee was asking a question, so he wanted to answer. What do you think? Who knows that the king hasn't spoken yet, the voice of Ancient One rang out in the library.
and the Sorcerer Supreme is there. But I didn't see it myself. For advanced magic use, basic magic represents the essence of all magic, and all extended magic is developed slowly based on basic magic, A.I. Lee replied. Sitting in his seat, Wang twitched his mouth, and he realized that he was no longer fit to listen here. Because in front of his eyes, A.I. Lee is talking to the void, and the person talking to him is Ancient One Magician, no accident should be soul astral, that is, Ancient One under astral projection. A.I. Lee can directly see the Sorcerer Supreme under the astral projection, but he cannot see it himself. Heartbroken. The spirit body of Ancient One stood aside, watching A.I. Lee's study and couldn't help but sigh. This guy's ability is really amazing, it's as if A.I. Lee is no upper limit. Is such comprehension really something a human being can do? It's only been a while. The spirit is slowly leaving here, and she needs to see Emperor Waishan once, which is also one of the promises to A.I. Lee. Your understanding of magic has found its essence, and combined with the thought of refining God and meditation, you have an epiphany, and you have created casting magic. Forging magic, the method of casting magic power, which can condense the spirit to a greater extent, replace the investment required for meditation, and can forge one's own spiritual power all the time, with great growth potential. The moment he comprehended casting magic, A.I. Lee also had a clear understanding of the true meaning of magic. Chapter 22 A Small Gain? I will give you guidance and guidance. At this moment, it seemed that his eyes were no longer the same as before. Everything in the universe seemed to unfold in front of him. Countless colorful planets flashed before his eyes, and the galaxy washed everything like a flood. The huge meteorite impacted A. I. Lee's mind in the next second, and transformed into fixed star through his body. Countless pairs of giant hands pulled A. I. Lee together, as if they wanted to pull him into this endless abyss, and completely dissipate here. But A. I. Lee stood still, knowing that this was the essence of the world, and it was also the picture that Dr. Strange Strange experienced in the movie. The difference is that Strange was brought here by Ancient One, but he came here on his own initiative. And the other party is a member of this mortal being, and I am a bystander watching the changes here. A planet is the dust of the universe, and a flood is energy washing away the universe. Meteorites are the tears of the gods. Their energy is overflowing, but they cannot be caught. The giant hand is the energy of the outer dimension that attracts the magician, luring them to indulge in it. Aili analyzed everything here. He knew that what he saw was the essence of energy and the essence of the universe. This place may be a small corner of the universe, and he was able to come here because he had come into contact with the essence of spiritual power, eternal attention. Let's go out. The important role here is to make magicians believe in idealism, see more magical energy here, and find their own way to use it. And I firmly believe in magic. The next moment, the world seemed to hear the voice of A.I. Lee, and the whole person left the ritual directly. Returning to the real world, the book in front of him was still in his hand, he turned and walked to the table, opened it and looked opposite. King. Fell asleep. Looking at the other party again, A.I. Lee's eyes revealed the existence of Chi, this time he saw Wang who was excited and jumped up on the spot. Excited? Wang finally mastered astral projection. No, to be precise, he had to try countless times to use astral projection before, and the success rate was about one-tenth. And just now he listened to A.I. Lee's words, directly cut off the latitude energy of Emperor Waishan, and only tried with his original strength. One success, but the price is that the energy in the body is directly emptied. It is impossible to use it again without rest for ten days and a half months. But it also means that what A.I. Lee said is right. Excited, he jumped up directly. Landing on the ground, feeling a gaze, Wang turned his head in embarrassment and saw A.I. Lee looking at him. I understand, I understand, no need to explain. Seeing his forced expression, A.I. Lee knew that this guy was shy, so he opened his mouth and looked down at the book. No, I didn't, don't get me wrong. Denying Sanlian did not break the deadlock, and the embarrassed Wang could only retract his words. But this success made him so excited that he didn't want to return to his body, so he wandered around in the library. It was not until I felt that my mental strength was exhausted that I was reluctant to return to my seat. Artilda. After returning to the original body and saying hello directly, Wang waved his hands and prepared to go to rest. Look here, and remember to close the door when you leave. N. A. I. Lee, who was immersed in the sea of books, responded. After the other party left, A. I. Lee was still studying magic. The power of magic is the power of one's own mind and spirit. If it is not enough, one must find eternity, that is, 
the environmental energy and the universe to improve oneself. A.I. Lee thinks about her current situation, looking for the power that suits her. Forget about the Mephistos at the Latitude. They are all cannibals. I really think there is no harm in trading with them. Unless you don't have enough energy, don't look for them. Which of the four gods is a bit difficult? Eternal energy is in the cosmic environment, such as teleportation and energy waves, but it will fail when it reaches out to latitudes. The strongest of my spiritual and spiritual power is Qi. The source of Qi is the power of the spiritual body and the forging of S cells. Coupled with the current casting magic, I can cast magic power by myself, which is to increase the atmosphere. Promote. Etc. In this way, isn't my Qi originally magic power? If there is no problem, casting magic is to increase my Qi, and S cells are also increasing Qi. The increase of Qi means that the magic power is improved. Casting magic forges magic power all the time. My magical power is also improving endlessly. A.I. Lee suddenly found that everything was integrated together. He thought that Qi was originally all his energy. Qi can be used as magic power to use magic, Qi can attach to the body to increase defense, and Qi can be shot out of the body as Kaigong waves. A.I. Lee was found his own way, that is, his own magic power will become his own source. The environmental magic power brought by eternity to this universe, or the power lent by the Mephisto contract in the outer latitude, is not as good as his own power. Next, learn magic. After confirming these, A.I. Lee also started to really learn magic. Theory is one part and so is practice. Understand that the essence can indeed use magic power as one likes, but what the predecessors have created can definitely be borrowed, Tilda. Watching the sun rise with some fatigue, this night really made A.I. Lee feel very fulfilled. Learning is boring, but if you understand something while studying, you will feel refreshed. That's what A.I. Lee is now. A.I. Lee, how are you? You already understand the basics of magic? At this moment, Modu, who was in charge of teaching, saw him appear and greeted him. The magicians in the four weeks are still in morning class, conducting unified teaching, and the teacher who takes them to class is Modu. It's not bad, I've learned something. A.I. Lee nodded, and learned a few more spells by himself. Oh? It seems very sure. Modu smiled when he saw his self-confidence. The magician who just arrived is like this, and he is complacent when he sees a little bit. It seems that A.I. Lee is no exception. I have to give him lessons to let him know the vastness of the magic universe, so that he can study hard. Magic also needs to lay a good foundation, and you can't be too ambitious, understand? Modu said. That's right. A.I. Lee agreed with his words, and he felt the same way, so he studied the basics all night. Tell me about your games. Modu was very pleased to see that A.I. Lee did not retort as expected. Immediately prepare to guide him. Let him say something first, correct me, correct me, that's all. Ask for flowers, please ask for monthly tickets, please support, thank you. Chapter 23 Magical Properties, Mordo Surprise I won't mention the basic magic knowledge, I have learned a few magics through the main research. Seeing that Modu was so interested and not hiding anything, A.I. Lee decisively took out the magic he had just learned. Threesome must have my teacher. Although A.I. Lee is very sure of his understanding, but the other party has been a magician for so many years, he must have his own opinions. If you can say something useful, it will help you too. How many have you learned? Modu was surprised by A.I. Lee's words. Magic is not a gun. You can shoot it after playing for a while and say you have learned it. As for A.I. Lee, Modu felt a little watery in it. The first one, Magic Shield. A.I. Lee nodded, and when he raised his hand, the silk thread emerged in his hand. Swipe and pull with both hands, the silk thread expands and becomes a whole surface. A golden shield just appeared in front of A.I. Lee's eyes. Very, very good. There was a look of surprise in Modu's eyes, and he actually succeeded once. Looking at A.I. Lee, I found him very relaxed. This also means that the opponent's proficiency in using this magic is already very high. Feel free to use this magic, has reached the level of graduation. You are indeed a genius. Your ability is very high. No wonder the Ancient One magician values it so much. Modu still thought that A.I. Lee came here as an apprentice, a sect of teachers. However, there is no end to the road of learning. Although your ability is high, there are also people with stronger abilities in the universe. Don't slack off. Come, let's see the next magic. After Modu boasted, he still reminded him that he had seen some magicians with abilities bursting with self-confidence after being proud. 
then no one will look down on someone who is not afraid of anything, like I am the best in the world. Eventually went astray. AI Lee's performance is good, but it's just a magic shield after all. Entry level magic, it's not enough for me to praise him to the sky. The next words are magic weapons, which seems to be a common spell of Kamataj. So that's what I started learning. AI Lee said to him, and his hands began to change. This. When Modu saw him start to show the next magic, he wanted to remind. This magic shield has not been cancelled, you have to disperse this magic before casting the next one. Bus Tilda. The golden magic shield changes in the hands of AI Lee. The whole face directly began to distort the shape, and then became completely slender. In the next moment, all the magic power of the magic shield was condensed into a spear, which was held by A. Eilie. Grab the handle of the gun and stomp it down. The tail of the gun hit the ground directly, and a hole was punched out of the marble floor tiles. The split mouth goes all around, extending in all directions. One meter of floor tiles turned into honeycomb cracks. R. Modul was dumbfounded watching this scene, and couldn't help but speak out in surprise. The apprentices who have been training behind, or the magicians who are not yet experienced also saw this scene. They all showed shock, thinking that they had seen a ghost. The proficiency of using magic mainly depends on their using speed, fluency, and the integrity of the magic after use. Now AI Lee is performing perfectly to the point of perfect use. This guy seems to have just arrived yesterday, so he rubbed them on the ground? Is anyone's gap really that big? A group of magicians caught in doubt. A little autistic. You, you just changed your appearance? Modu asked in surprise. After the general magic is used, the magic power must be dispersed before the next use. Because these magic powers are all borrowed Mephisto powers, most of which belong to Y. Sandy. You asked someone to borrow it, and after using it, you definitely have to borrow it again if you want to use other magic again. So the second magic to reuse. But on AI Lee's side, after using it up, he directly transformed the unused mana into the next mana. This does not conform to the agreement signed with Weishandi to use it. That's right, isn't this modeling magic or magic weapon just a change in magic power? AI Lee replied with a nod. Since it is a change in shape, why not just change the next one, why bother to put it away? Didn't you take off your pants and fart? Definitely, AI Lee also knows that this is because these magics use his own power, which is Qi. Use your own chi as you want. Unlike many magicians whose power is borrowed, they have to borrow it once from the latitude Mephisto like Vizandi, and they have more restrictions. Yes, it is indeed this theory. It is very good that you can see through it. After listening to A.I. Lee's words, Modu felt that this guy is really a genius. But as a mentor, he can't be too surprised in front of so many students, otherwise how can he teach others in the future? Focusing on A.I. Lee's gun, Modu wanted to ask something. But considering the apprentices around him, he couldn't speak in the end. Now that you have reached this point and demonstrated your ability, it is indeed time to learn other magic. Don't be arrogant, you must take one step at a time. This is for you. The bronze yellow ring was handed over to A.I. Lee, and Morton's expression was still a little dazed, as if he was thinking about something. After receiving the ring, A.I. Lee took a look at it and knew it was a holy place magic weapon. Sling ring. Sling ring is a magic weapon to help magicians use the portal, and other magic can also be used as a booster. We are not born with extremely powerful spiritual power like Sorcerer Supreme. So this thing can help us. You have to take care to protect him. After finishing speaking, Modu hesitated for a while and continued. Well, regarding the spells of basic magic weapons, you should also pay more attention to the effects of their characteristics. If you have any ideas, you can come to me later, and I will help you take a look. After finishing speaking, Modu looked away from the tail of the spear transformed by A. I. Lee, looking very concerned. I see. Thank you, Modu, magician. A. I. Lee nodded in understanding, picked up the sling ring, turned and walked towards his room. This thing is a bit interesting, you can study it. As for the magic characteristics that Modu just mentioned, he also understands the theory. Because that's what he spends most of his time studying at night. Magic properties are also characteristics when using magic. Chapter 24 Portal Magic Contacts in Space In fact, the characteristics of magic should be a unique attribute. It's nonsense, how can it be called a characteristic if it is not unique? A.I. Lee looked at the spear in his hand, 
felt the chi flowing out of his body and condensed in front of him, and knew what Moja was talking about. The spear turned into a magic shield, and the golden shield didn't look very thick, but he knew that the defense power of this thing was amazing. It is no exaggeration to say that it is simple to directly block the next shell. Chi originally has a defensive effect. AI Li has tried it before. I don't know what level the maximum level can reach. Thinking of the enemies he might face in the future, AI Li wanted to give it to try. Can thermal missiles resist it? What if it's radiation? After the air is attached to the surface of the body, the bullets of ordinary pistols can't make a trace, and his body is like scratching. Recalling the Dragon Balls I watched, when I was a child, Sun Wukong was not injured at all when facing the bullets with red ribbons. This is because of the defense of Qi. The defense of the magic shield is powerful, with a sense of thickness, just like the solidity of the land. This is the characteristic. Then turn it into a long sword and pierce it out. The moment the sword tip touched the cabinet, it poked a hole directly, without any sound like stabbing tofu. This is the sharpness of magic weapons. And the sharpness of bows and arrows, the sharpness of fan tips. Modu should be a little surprised by what I just did. He wants me to go and find him to discuss. I want to know why my spear has two characteristics. Aili is not stupid, you still have your own understanding of your understanding and strength. Modu thought he was a magic apprentice who had just come into contact with the extraordinary world and knew nothing. So while encouraging myself, while suppressing my arrogance. At the same time, I want to know how A.I. Lee achieves that magic weapons have two characteristics, and it would be embarrassing not to ask them directly. So let yourself have time to find him in private, and even call it a look for yourself. In fact, he wanted to understand why the tip of A.I. Lee's magic spear is sharp and indestructible, and the end has a full sense of thickness, tearing the ground. This is the mastery of Qi, that is, the manipulation of magic power. It's useless to tell him about subtle manipulation, because he can only rely on the other party to try it himself. Savvy is something that covers all aspects, not just one of them. A.I. Lee understands that when he started to learn magic, the effect of comprehension has already appeared. As long as he starts to think about any content about magic, he will get the answer and integrate it. With both hands out, a magic weapon appeared in A.I. Lee's left and right hands. Left hand knife, right hand sword. In the next second, the Miao Dao in the left hand instantly changed shape shifting into a pistol. The sword in the right hand becomes a fan, similar to the one in Ancient One's hand. TSK. Looking at the shape of the pistol, A.I. Li smiled and pulled the trigger. The magic ray shot out like a bullet and hit the wall. Boom. A.I. Li had been prepared for a long time before shooting, and he waved his fan, and a magic power rushed directly to the wall and turned into a protective shield. The bullet hit it and was blocked. Otherwise, this room is afraid that a hole will be broken, and even the houses behind it will be destroyed. Another way to use Kaigong waves, but it's meaningless, it's better. A.I. Lee felt the passing of the magic power was extremely small, and then the pistol disappeared. He stretched out his hand directly, pointed his index finger at the position just now and lifted it slightly, and the magic bullet was fired again. Somewhat similar to Dongbo in Dragon Ball. It's better to be more straightforward. She retracted her fingers in satisfaction. Air Lee's eyes fell on the sling ring. Holy place magician everyone has a magic weapon, this thing was developed by Ancient One. The purpose is to help ordinary magicians who cannot use their own power to contact the eternal environmental magic to open the portal. Auxiliary artifacts are very useful, but if you rely on this thing, if you don't have a sling ring, you can't use the portal, which will make the magician feel that it is necessary to open the portal. It also leads to a deepening of the sense of dependence, and finally the cognition of idealism is wrong. It becomes really impossible to use without sling ring. Magic artifact. Playing with the ring in the palm of his hand, A.I. Lee took out another magic weapon that he had now. Eye of Agamotto. These two are not at the same level, there is also a time gem inside. Ancient One is not afraid that I will run away with this thing. Is my character so trustworthy? Or, she has a way to recognize the Lord. It should be like this. A.I. Lee remembers the origin and effect of these magic tools, which are recorded in a few of the tens of thousands of books in the library. Although the space is small, it is described. I don't know how many magicians will look at these huge unimportant knowledge. The magic weapon is also the magic house. It is a temporary magic object created by various Mephisters or big magicians. It is full of power and at the same time communicates with the creator, transmitting magic power all the time. 
the Eye of Agamotto, the Levitating Cloak, the Book of Knowledge, and the Staff of Wathum are all such magical objects. Some are obtained from Eternal God. Ai Li looked at the Eye of Agamotto, which is what Ancient One got from Eternal. And the Floating Cloak is collected from the Trial of Vizandi. The Book of Knowledge is a magic weapon obtained after passing the Death Trial. Ancient One is really amazing. I have seen two gods, and I have a latitude Mephisto like Vizandi, and now I am competing with that guy Dormammu. It's no wonder that one of the strongest on earth exists. Put away the Eye of Agamotto, the concept of this thing is too high, and the power contained is also very exaggerated. Also, the existence of Time Gem can almost be said to be a rule, and it is better to deliberate later. Ai Li set his sights on the Sling Ring, and now the focus should be on this portal. Teleportation relies on the eternal magic of the environment. Sling Ring makes it easier for users to connect with the magic of the environment, and then use this ubiquitous magic to imagine where they need to go. In this way, a special portal is opened, allowing people to reach the opposite side directly. Analyzing the existence of the portal, recalling the theory about the portal that I saw in the book. The magic of space is hard. But it's not impossible. Your research on portals has gradually deepened, and with the accumulation of countless theoretical knowledge, you have found the true meaning of portal magic. You have an epiphany. You are proficient in magic, portal. Learn? This is simply not enough. A.I. Lee's goal is not to learn a simple portal magic. Chapter 25 Comprehension of Teleportation, Earth of Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon It's no surprise to learn a portal, A.I. Lee's goal is not this. First. This magic needs to rely on the effect of environmental magic power, that is, the magic power overflowing from eternity in this universe. If not, it is obvious what the result is. If you encounter Mephister in other latitudes, in the other dimension, this magic cannot be used at all. Continue to study. My portal can't be so simple. A.I. Lee gnawed at the book again, and the key points of space magic were constantly infiltrating in his mind. The most important thing is that he is also constantly using the portal to get in touch with the effect and experience of this magic. If Ali's movements froze, and then he thought of the magic power he used, that is, his own chi. What if I had the characteristics of chi to perception? Thinking of this, he couldn't stop his movements. The existence of chi is very special, even more special than the magic power of this universe. It is a very cool thing for him to be able to realize the use of chi, and now it can come in handy. Connecting the particularity of Chi to the portal, A.I. Lee started trying again and again. Finally, after working hard for a long time, a big smile appeared on A.I. Lee's face. You have deepened your understanding of space on the basis of the portal, and with the blessing of Chi, the magic of the portal has improved again. You have an epiphany. You create new magic, teleportation. Teleportation, use air as a medium to perceive your own object, and use space magic to reach the other party in an instant. It's finally done. Teleportation, this is a very portable magic. In Dragon Ball, it is the magic held by the Adrat star. It is very difficult to practice. After A. Ilix got the ability of Chi, he always wanted to realize this skill. It's a pity that he has no clue at all, even if his understanding is against the sky, he can't go from zero to one. It's as if you ask a person what is one plus one, and the person who hasn't been to school but knows the answer tells you that one plus one equals two. But if you ask him again why one plus one equals two, he will say that one plus one equals two. This answer is correct as it is logical explanation. But if you are looking for the answer and looking for a mathematical explanation, even if you have been to school or university, even a PhD cannot explain it to you. This is the difference between going from zero to one and going from one Newton. A.I. Lee's savvy is against the sky, but what he needs is an opportunity. Only by finding this opportunity can we unleash our endless comprehension, explore the truth, or reach the peak. The power of teleportation. A.I. Lee started to diffuse perception with Chi, amplified his Chi bit by bit, and started to explore. Teleportation is very powerful, he can go directly from one place to another. But there is also a gap, that is, it is necessary to sense the other party's chi to instantly move to the other party's position. So this trick can't go where no one is. And if the opponent's chi is too far away, or too weak to be sensed, it is impossible to go there. Ali's chi is the perception of the other party, and soon, his perception has reached the entire Himalayas, including it. Not enough, this distance is not my upper limit. Ali is not sure how strong his own strength is, 
but what is certain is that his S cells have reached a terrifying point. It is no exaggeration to say that it may have exceeded 30%. To be more specific, the S cells in his body have surpassed the number in ordinary Saiyans, and are almost the same as the legendary Super Saiyans. S cells are the source of his forging chi foundation, and he hasn't practiced for so long, so it hasn't been thick enough to reach the end of Dragon Ball, when a single induction directly covers the whole universe. But under the control of A.I. Li, in an instant, his chi covered more than half of the Earth. The exaggerated amount is astonishing. A.I. Li still wants to continue to expand, but unfortunately, it seems that it is still a little bit short. Maybe it is because my chi has not made the qualitative leap, so it is limited. Super Saiyan. Every time I feel my upper limit, A.I. Li cares more and more about this level. The evolution of Saiyans, Super Saiyans, the strength can be improved by leaps and bounds, and the combat power can be increased by 50 times in an instant. Super Race 1 is 50 times the normal amount, which is included in the Dragon Ball Encyclopedia. That's all, if A.I. Li's current strength is directly increased by 50 times. The basic physical strength must be satisfied. Under normal circumstances, the stronger my strength is, the stronger the Super Race will be. He clearly understands that if the normal state is increased by 1%, the evolved power is not as simple as 1%. It's still too weak, and the chi of many existences can hardly be felt. A.I. Li was looking for those special chi in the perception. Jin Bing has the strength, and his combat power is much stronger than normal people. His chi, A.I. Li quickly found and confirmed it. At the same time, he also saw several unusual beings, and their aura was also very strong. However, these existences seem to have sealed themselves somewhere, and did not mix in the crowd. No, there are a few who are quite powerful. A.I. Li raised his brows, and took an angry perception of these special guys, which he didn't know before. Far away in Tibet, he actually saw two gatekeepers sitting there, one on the left and one on the right, and the chi in their bodies was quite strong. At least ten golds in start. There are also some special chi in the city, their chi is different from that of the people on earth and it is quite strong. Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. After trying it, Ellie's figure instantly disappeared from the spot. Huh? Jinbin was taken aback suddenly. He seemed to feel someone standing behind him just now, but when he turned around, there was nothing there. Turning his head again, he saw Ellie standing in front of him. You? Are you back? Jin didn't know how the other party did it, but as his own child, he didn't feel scared either. And without questioning, Ailee would naturally not hide it from him if he wanted to say it. Not saying it makes sense. Pass by, Dad, work hard to start a career, and I'll surprise you when I'm done. After Ailee finished speaking, she put her finger between her eyebrows. In the next moment, it disappeared again, 